Wow, that was a cool American flag. <laughs> Hi, welcome to Foreververse. I'm Jason Charles Miller. Foreververse, three-hour show where I just play songs for three hours. Ah, I'm just kidding. Uh, Amy's sick today, so I'm going to play a song solo. Um, uh, but granted, she gets better in the next nine days. Uh, we wanted to announce that we're going to be performing at South by Southwest at the Nerdist Backyard Bash, Friday, March 10th. So we're going to be there repping uh, Geek and Sundry. We'll be uh, taking over Facebook Live there. We'll be taking over Instagram. And we'll be throwing back to the um, the anniversary uh, of uh, Geek and Sundry Twitch as well. This is one of the songs we're going to play. This is one that we wrote for Foreververse a few weeks ago um, when we were playing 7th C. And this one's called In This Town. In this town, they don't know your name. No one cares, you gotta make your own way. Deaf to every word that you say. In this town. In this town, people pass you by. They'll look at the ground before they look you in the eye. You can't tell the truth from a lie. In this town, gotta make it alone. In this town, you forget how it feels. In this town, you meet the end of the road. In this town, they'll never let you go. In this town, they'll feed on your feet. You're weak and your justice is here. Your soul becomes a cheap souvenir. In this town, you can't get out a back door. Nothing's enough, they'll just keep taking more. You're not the only one keeping score. In this town. In this town, you learn how to make it alone. In this town, you forget how it feels to be home. In this town, you meet the end of the road. In this town, they'll never let you go. Fishers wharf is out by the sea. The church is all by the air. The market's in the middle. But my place in this town, my nowhere. In this town, you learn how to make it alone. In this town, you forget. How it feels to be home in this town. You meet the end of the road in this town. They'll never let you go. Marketing start. He was already his amazing so large. But this is this is his <laughs> this is his forever verse solo debut. Thank you, Mr. Jason Charles Miller, for in this town, which is a uh, very pointed because today we are playing a new system called The Witch Is Dead. Oh my God, we're in a new system with a new guest. Hi, Erica. You all, as you all may have been aware, if you are long-standing watchers of Foreververse, but if you're not, and this is new to you, uh, Miss Hirschberger has baby Hirschberger to take care of right now. And um, there is a seat for Miss Erica at our table to join us in our little 
Miscreant Adventure Time. I will do my best. You're going to do amazing. So, uh, yeah, and then as Jason mentioned, Amy is out sick. Nothing serious, mind you. She's just a little under the weather, and we don't want her to infect the rest of us. Um, yeah. So The Witch is Dead is a new little system that we're going to be exploring today, and before we get into our adventure, I will just explain it briefly. Uh, it is a one-page RPG that you actually can get for free online. In fact, I found this on Imgur, so. Uh, it is an RPG about murder, and the prompt is thus. Once upon a time, there was a kind and wise and beautiful witch who lived in the forest with her familiars, and her life was peaceful and happy until a fucking witch hunter broke into her cottage and dragged her out and fucking murdered her, and now she's dead, right? But if you get revenge and kill him and bring his eyes to her corpse within a week, she'll come back to life. Or so you've heard. Even if it doesn't work, at least he's dead. So that is the system we're gonna be playing uh, for the, I won't say the foreseeable future because we said that on 7th C and we saw how that lasted. There will be a definite finite amount of episodes for this and so join us as we continue our adventure on the Foreververse. <laughs> Uh, great. So, um, The Witch is Dead. One of the interesting things about The Witch is Dead is, is, uh, the players are all familiars. And now we've played animals on this show before, but we've played kind of anthropomorphic animals of some sort. In this game, they're legitimately animals, which yeah, look. means... Yeah, look. at us. Yeah, you, it was kind of like, I, I don't think, um, I think the, actually the only person who was here for The Secret of Cats was Hector. Do you remember that game? I don't, but it says... <laughs> <laughs> I love that you don't even remember don't it. Don't even remember it. Whimsical. What, was it right before Pugmire? Uh, no, it wasn't. It was when we had uh, Marisipen, uh was that fake course system in which you were all cats and it was in a haunted ghost town. This happened. Um, Come on, Hector. Was it, I there? Was it I there was no there? survivors. It was... Uh, oh, yeah. wait. You're Is it oh, coming? Yeah, 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 yeah. Is it yeah. coming? Yeah, yeah, it was, yeah, yeah, you were all different we're on the types couch. of cats. We're on the couch. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I forget what kind of You're on the couch. I'm really glad I wasn't here for that. Though. We were on the couch. That's how that's how like yep. No Survivors has moved into Forever versus right. some time. That that's how long ago it's been. <laughs> no one's a cat wow. today though, right? Remember nope. the nope. original was Critical Rejects. It was Critical Rejects, right. <laughs> yeah. Which we still use that name for when I occasionally run off and do a a like one off like Theoretically, No Survivors was when we did that little paranoia game. Totally off tangent, guys. I'm sorry. But No Survivors was when we did that little paranoia one-off game. But Critical Rejects was, we did like three games under that name. Which was just, and then they, they're in the, mm -hmm. the twitchy ether, as they say. But, <clears throat> your story starts as thusly. You've all awoken from the blinding white light of which you are now used to being the marker stone that says that you've dreamt. And as the white light dissipates from your vision, you notice that you are inside a dark two-room cottage. Herbs hang from the ceiling and several bowls of ground meal are laid out on a small wooden table. Your perspective seems to be in a much different place than what you're used to looking high as everything around you seems to come from either a fisheye lens or from just a very honey I shrunk the kids kind of perspective where everything is bigger than they normally would be. You, as you begin to, vision begins to clear, you start to notice that there is various woodwork lying on the edge of every single window as well as a simple chimney that has a large iron kettle that's boiling a, a fine viscous fluid amongst a roaring fire. Then, the smell of blood as the humidity pierces your senses and you see as a figure of a man is shutting the front door with a body laid out in front of him. You watch as he drops a smoldering pile of moss and peat into a bowl as he's exiting out the door. You watch as smoke begins to billow from the jar and begins to catch flame. What do you do? By the way, as you apparently looking down, you <laughs> notice that your hand runs. <laughs> row, row. <laughs> Can we communicate with each other? So this is how communication is going to work with you as the animals. You all have a telepathic link. 
you don't have to speak dog in order to talk to each other. But communicating to other flora and fauna is through kind of... Any, anybody have the ability to speak with humans? I don't. No. Mm. no. I look around and I look around the room and I look at my companions and I see who, who, who what do I see? Well, you see a hair that seems to have been kind of nuzzling itself inside of the corner, nibbling on some various foliage with, uh, with, <laughs> I know you have this picture of you with your, with right. your cigarette inside right. of your mouth. Right, I, I, <laughs> so. you, I'm a very specific rabbit. I got those crazy eyes, uh, yeah. like so. I think we can, do we have, do we have that? I don't we should. Yeah. They'll put oh, it in, put chat. It in yeah. the chat. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's me. That's you. And so you see a very uh, crazy-eyed looking rabbit sitting around, kind of, you know, blazingly putting their little ears up. What else do you see? You see a uh, dark red fox with uh, very cool markings, you know, on its chest. And it's like it's almost like a, a star on its forehead. It's natural or like maybe the witch? No, 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 it's natural. Like, you know, okay. the famili- it being a familiar, it looks a little different than normal foxes. Right, right, right cool. So, and it's, uh, it's, it's looking at the body and looking at the door like, no, this won't stand. <laughs> and you also see in the corner right next to a table leg, what you think at first is like a rock or like a decorative thing, but it's just a very, very still toad. Very still. Not even moving at all. Nice. And when you look over at me, you see a, uh, an, an old hound dog. He's, he's a blue tick hound dog. And he's uh, just, you know, he's beside himself because he just, he's freaking out. He's like running around in circles. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> uh, yeah as, as the watch is the smoke and now the bowl is definitely catching fire. Okay, we and need to do something about that. You can see <laughs> as it's starting to... Uh, it's spreading out from the wooden bowl that it is now in. The bowl itself is currently aflame. The door um, is shut. Door is shut. Is it? Are there any? A handle or what? How is it shut? Uh, it handle? is shut with a latch. Oh. Like a bolt. Can you um, wait, 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 wait? Are there I any have... water sources nearby? Buckets of you water can, in the corner. You can, jugs? you can look around if you'd like. I, I have yes. look around. A spell that allows me to lock, unlock, open, or close. Oh, oh nice, awesome. Oh, oh that's, okay. that's one of the spells you. Uh, Everybody have spells. Right. Everyone to get Everyone one spell. Everyone gets one spell. Did you pick? And a spell? you got lock, unlock, I open, I ro- close. I rolled I for it. Right. So I did rolled, I. Yeah. That's yeah. what, you think I'd pick lock on lock? <laughs> well, so no, everyone, yeah. everyone did, and did you du- did? So if there's a double up on spells, I'll allow one of you a reroll. Oh, I got plant growth. Okay. Because everyone, you. everyone basically got to get one spell that toad. the witch kind of imparted. Which got toad? What can you toad, do, toad has got tidy, oh. which means uh, I guess clean and mend. Nice. Okay. What do you got? Mend Mine is Wally unhelpful in this situation. I can make fire. <laughs> So we'll use that later. Wait, what about that phrase, fight fire with fire? Hold on, hold on to that. Oh, shit. Hold on to that, not yet. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I am going to use can my we, magic could... to open the door. How difficult is this? Okay, so this one, we're gonna set at a difficulty. So a quick way to explain people how the system of the Witch's Dead works. It's a basic D10 system with a challenge rating. I set a challenge, and that player then gets to roll a die and add the stat which is usually anywhere from one to four for one of their four core stats, clever, fierce, sly, and quick. They add that number to their D10. If they beat the challenge rating, you succeed. If you don't, um, or something bad happens, you can accumulate a resource called danger. And if at any time you basically fail something, you get a danger point. If at any time you're doing a check and you roll under your danger, you're incapacitated, lost, dead, stolen, whatever it is. So you don't want to accumulate danger as much as you possibly can. But it's also not a death sentence if you do. Um, so your challenge rating for this is because this, this is a magical lock and the witch herself put a spell on it in order to make sure that nothing, no people got in or out of her cottage. But the guy just walked really out. She's not really worked out. <laughs> What's that? The guy just walked out. And I she's know. Dead. Is but the magic still valid? But the but well, your magic's still valid. You are the familiars of the witch, and obviously there is oh, right. uh, there is something going on with the witch too. If she can be beheaded, but yet your magic is still working. Okay. Still, you're fighting mm. the witch's magic lock, which gives you a challenge rating of nine. 
can do this. I can't. Wait, wait. So what? What's the appropriate uh, stat for this? So for your spell, mm-hmm. you're uh, duh, 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 duh. you're basically you could probably take. I think sly is going to be pretty much everything with magic. So it's going to go against your sly stat. Really? <laughs> you're a fox and you're not sly. No, the st- foxes are not sly. That is a critical failure right there. How much you get? Would you roll one? I rolled a one. <laughs> right. We're yeah. starting off this well, picture with a bag. So, uh, Foxes are slyer than dogs, because you've got a sly of one. Yeah. I've got a sly of zero. Mm. Who's so got better sly? Who's got slyer a, than a fox? Spears of, <laughs> I know. A spider's got a three? I mean, that is weird. What? A cat has a three? Should be sly. <laughs> Not slyer than a fox, though. I'm going to write that's a, like the that's a misconception, though, that foxes are sly. I'm write is a it strongly so? worded yeah, letter. You're not even quick, like in the sentence. I know, right? Yeah, I'm writing a strongly clever. worded letter to the creator of this. Clever well, you can find them on Imgur. And oh, is he clever? Uh, yeah. yeah, I'm pretty clever, That too. makes okay. sense. So yeah, clever, no, clever like a fox. Right. Well, are there any other points of egress? Well, hold on. <laughs> Here's what happens, first of all. So as the fox, <laughs> shaking off whatever reverie, as uh, Nathaniel um, suddenly realizes that he's in a, in a fox's body <laughs> and looks at the door, and as you said, this will not stand, he reaches inside of his body and realizes, holy shit, there's magic coursing through this fox's body. Well, that's interesting. And as you look at the lock, you realize that I could open this, and you think about it, but not being really familiar with your powers or the fact that you're just kind of jumping right off the back and knowing <coughs> that this is a magically tripped lock, uh, you watch as a as you, as you basically focus on this lock and you hear this <laughs> fizzling as a small amount of um, uh, uh, like like a little bit of uh, vaporous gas kind of <laughs> comes out from the front of it, like you were like you were to, to empty a balloon out suddenly. Mm-hmm. And you watch as that gas kind of licks parts of the flame as suddenly a small explosion boom, oh, awesome. <gasps> erupts inside of the room and suddenly the flash point of the fire, which was currently just simmering in a bowl at the moment, but now it's catch the entire wall of the door on fire. Okay. Anybody have wet? I have the opposite of that. No, that's not gonna help. Okay. Take a danger point. Single danger point. Yeah, right off the bat. This is awesome. Uh, are there any other points of egress? <laughs> you can keep looking. If you want to roll uh, roll some sly, it'd be a simple task at six. Uh, 11. You got 11 total? Yeah. Okay, so there's a couple things <laughs> that seem to be around as far as egress goes. There are windows, okay? They're shut at the moment, but it seems like maybe you could pry them open. Um, there is, uh, the it's a, it's a dirt floor as well. Um, you could also see that there is a couple of small areas in between the doors that maybe you or the toad could fit through as well. Um, there's also the chimney, which currently has a smaller fire than what is cur- what is on the door at the moment that seems to be in place. You think I... Could, could I slam into the door and to try right. to... Doors on fire, it but it doesn't you matter if it's locked. If it's if it disintegrates. Jump out the window! We, Jump out the window! Do we it! Also, we also need but to what bury the guys? body. We need to bury the body. And unless we can break the door open, we need to bury her body because otherwise it's going to burn up. Well, her, the body's outside. Oh, it's outside. Yes. Oh, windows. Yeah, jump out the window. Jump out the window. <laughs> we'll follow. Or we just need everyone, it to get open. Everyone. Okay, fine. Then, or everyone jump on my back and I jump out. I can get out. Well, the windows are shut. Fox. Oh. You'd have oh, to lift so them just, open. Can I try is, again? Isn't it just, isn't it just glass? Can, I mean, he, can't he just go out? Is it a out? glass window? Yes, but it's that kind of medieval Super, glass. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That is uh, a little the old thicker, glass the oldie glass. Really. All right, yeah. I'm gonna shake up and look at that window and think, open. <laughs> <laughs> the window's a little simpler. Uh, it is a six. Eight. Eight, all right. Yeah. So you watch as the window <laughs> clips open ever so suddenly, you got some grasp on your powers and you focus on this window and watch as it just boom, opens up ever so slightly. Uh, I, I say this, but really it just goes like right. that because all those kind of old-timey windows yeah, were, were, yeah, shutter type, shutter were shutter types. So you watch as it boom, slaps open a little bit. You see a couple cracks along it as it's widely open. Um, if you want to jump through with everyone on your back dog, uh, then you're definitely going to have to be making a quick check. I can just before, that's fine, but I was thinking maybe just the because fr- you could jump out and you could jump out, but if the frog yeah. maybe wants to frog. jump, it's a frog. Frogs back. can jump. <laughs> yeah, but I don't know it's how high thing. the frog can jump. How high is this window? It's a, uh, it's about five, six feet high. 
Oh, it's like up. It's well, I'm sorry. It's it's about four feet high because it is about the level that you would expect the window at. Frog, a pretty you pretty uh jump? pretty tall for even the dog to get up there because he's gonna have to jump on the table, which is currently a fire, oh. in order to get up to it as well too. Unless we jump on each other and kind of. All right, let's let yeah, Bremen Town musicians this cheerleader yeah. style. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I think we need to. What right, are so you, you thinking, can... Toad? To correct everyone, I am a toad. <laughs> and I am simply going to make my way to the little crevice that is in between walls that I can squeeze my smaller body through. All right, that is going to be a, um, a quick four, if you don't mind. Not at all. <laughs> quick. All right, with, I rolled a three, but then my quick is a one. So, so that's that a four. I met you four. I you met, met which, <laughs> you, which you succeeded. Just, but just barely. So tell me how you barely got through there. Uh, the entire time this pandemonium is happening, I sense that our witch is outside, and I decide to to slowly hop my way over to that hole that is uh, uh, where the wall meets the dirt floor. There's a little bit of a, a burrowed hole. I've traveled through there before. And then I will my body through there, hop my way outside, and land right next to our dearly departed witch. Great. And as he does it, I yell out, Great job, frog! <laughs> Again, I am a toad. <laughs> I don't blame these creatures because they are not the same species as I, but we do have a telepathic link. They know my name. They know who I am. My name is Toad. I am a toad. <laughs> Great. Good deal, Paul. Uh, all right, all right uh, so shall we do this? All right. Bounce are you all hopping on Dog's back? Well, sure. I was going to hop on Dog's back and then hop out the window, not Great. That's, stay on that's what I'm yeah. doing. Yeah, use me as a... Okay. Quick six. Focal. Quick six. Everybody? Quick okay. six. No, in this case, only he has to roll it because you're all on his back. Oh. Okay, no. I rolled a ten. I rolled a, a zero. Great. A ten. Uh, paint the picture for me. Um, okay, everybody. So they're all jumping on my back? Yep. Everybody jump on my back. Let's do this. Let's do this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Play, 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 play. <laughs> jump through. <laughs> <laughs> up onto the counter and managing to barely escape the flames that are currently, again, like licking up onto the table. You go out through the front One door. One leap. One leap as you as you hop in through there and land onto the dirt floor. Do, 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 do. As you watch, as you can see the smoke from the cottage fire currently <laughs> seeping through the different boards as the uh, uh, as the cottage is is one hundred percent on fire. Uh, is there any water source around? There is definitely a stream close by. Oh, um, and of- the witch <laughs> does keep a well. Right. Um. Do we have any way of getting the water? I say we cut our losses. Yeah, you're probably right. Yeah. <laughs> Let's follow the, let, I'm going to use my hound dog senses to Ooh. try Wait! To, you can grow plants. I can. Yes, I can. What if you try to grow, grow some a plant around the, the bucket and then have it slowly? Or just like, grow plants around the thing to kind of suffuse the flame. Or at least slow it down somewhat. It might do something. Okay, yeah. I try to grow plants around, you mean around the whole the whole cottage? Yeah, to try to like That in, seems like a like Druid tall style. Task. I mean, you want- no offense, but yeah, it's probably not going to work. But it's better think- than sitting there watching it burn. Maybe could I sure least- that they're like wet plants, those kinds of. Plants or could you are- could you <laughs> grow some kind of plant that would like direct the stream towards the cottage? That's like a, a vine along the a large vine along the ground. What can you do? Don't look at me. Do you tell me what you want to do? Uh, well, uh, well, all I want to do is go chase after. The yeah, I say we wet. cut our. I say we cut our losses. I'm not attached to material possessions. That's not what she would have wanted. How do you know what she would have wanted? She did. <laughs> Excuse me. I think wait, I knew the witch a little better than you do. Do we need to bury the body? Because I can dig. I can dig. I can dig. I was thinking about that. We should dig. probably bury the body. All wait. right. If you want to dig. No, uh, none of us should bury the body. I heard, I heard that if we can bring back the witch hunter's eyes and some specific amount of time, that she will come back to life. She will, but we should bury the body to protect her so that the yeah, other she's she's gonna decay. Decay. No, 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 just no. But like, if you want to grow plants over it, go grow power over. You know her what? To if she'll it. come back, if she'll come back, if we get the eyes, then we should go get the eyes because then this is something Toad knows to be true. Right. He he looks at the body and goes, "We get the witch on his eyes." Well, if, okay. then we should then get the eyes. I will grow some plants over her body to at least protect her Bam. from like random deer coming by and like chewing on her hand or something. <laughs> Slice six. Deers don't really. <laughs> Slice <Okay>. seven. <laughs> <laughs> Slice seven. My experience. Uh, it, uh, put, mm, mm. No. no. So Maybe you you look at the body <laughs> for a minute and you watch as a sapling goes, and that's that's all you yeah, can see from there. 
all I can do right now. You're gonna have Sorry. to keep working on this magic. Okay. I can dig. I can dig. I can dig. <laughs> we can. We can. We can. Do, don't bury it. It's gonna just decompose underground. All right, let's Fine. go. Where did the witch hunter decompose? I'm gonna sniff around and see if I can find the witch hunter. You want to try to see if you can track down the set? Track him down. Yes. Wait, you're a hound dog. You're a hound dog. Yeah. Also, I would like to. Yeah. I would also like to examine the body and see if there's anything that'll point this in the direction or any evidence. On the body. Great, great. So, uh, you, um, for the hound dog, let's keep that up. That is a simple task for a hound dog, so let's yeah. keep that at a six. Man. Six what, though? Uh, six, um, clever. Okay. And, uh, yeah, got it. Man. All right. And I'm then, on the scent. You're on the scent? Look. Okay, so. You sniff, and not only uh, through the musk and the humidity and the blood, you can pick up the salty. Um, musk-like scent of a man just in battle who you're assuming is your witch hunter as he seems to have a very distinct trail on the path leading out from the cottage into the woods. Guys, I got the trail. Toad, jump on my back. The rest of us, let's go. And then Hare, in the meantime, you look at the body. Um, it is your witch. She had a long brown robe on um, with little danglies and eccentricities all over her. She's you don't know her as who you are, but you also, uh, by the way, has anyone uh, uh, cared to understand that, you know, not only is, is Nicole not here, but also Hope isn't here at the moment um, as part of your group? Just think about that as, as I continue to tell you what's going on. Okay. Um, well, there also there. seems to be a, uh, uh, the fact that the head is gone. It's She's gone, been decapitated. Gone? And there seems to be, uh, Literally, um, just a body there with a very clean and surprisingly not bloody pool in front of her, in which it seems to have been a very clean, off in one stroke kind of death. And uh, you can see she's got her potions and her baubles laid all around her, and yeah, it's a dead body. Do we need her to be intact in order for the eye spell to work? Well, I think we would need the head. The head seems like something we probably need. I'm thinking he's got it. In fact, can I use my scent to see if oh, I Oh yeah, he's got the head. Her? He's got the head, he's guys. Got the head. He's got the head. Son of a bitch. That's a problem. That's a problem. <laughs> yeah, you smell it. You smell it. Uh, it is definitely due south leading into the forest, which um, you've never really gone into the forest except for when the witch first found you. You've mostly just been hanging out, except for the frog, who is uh, very, very good at uh, running on little errands. The toad, I'm sorry, the toad was very, very good at running up little errands for the witch. I hang my toad head in sorrow because I'm going to miss this witch. She well, was good to back. me. We can, bring her, we can bring her back. But I am comforted with the fact <laughs> that we should be able to bring her back if we make haste. Then I jump on the hound dog's back and, and, and wrestle my slimy little toes into its fur to get a good grip, to get a good grip. And then I say to the hound dog, I, I we I know you from before, right? We we were just on a on a ship and then we went through a jungle. Right? I think you're right. I think we were on some sort of a pirate ship. I think your sister died. Oh yeah, thanks for reminding me. Where wait, is where she? Is your, I, she's sister? not here. I know. Where and where is, is wait? We, we're also missing. Um, we're also missing another one. And you? And you're new. Are new. Hmm. Crazy okay. bunny. Crazy Bunny's new. We got a new Crazy Bunny. We're, uh... You must be Hope's friends. Whoa. Yes. Okay. You know Hope? But there should be another one of you. Where's she? We don't know. We, don't that's know. a good question. We only know what uh, you know. Yeah, we, uh, that's an issue. I met Hope. She's around. You met, oh, she's around, okay, She's good. around. Good. She that's needed, great. you need my help. Oh, okay, well, um... So now I'm here. It seems like we got some business to attend to. Yeah, I think you're right. We're missing Jade. Where's anybody? Know anything about Jade? I, I don't know. You met know. Jade? I she didn't die. I don't know her. Mm. This jumping. I didn't meet her in the void. She, I mean, she didn't die. It's and really, what about? Um, yeah, really confusing. Yeah, we lost people I know. in the void. Um, I don't. Because I don't. I don't have any idea. We should probably be on this trail as we're having this conversation. There's no time to. Yeah, yeah I mean, if we can talk so mentally, then let's just yeah, we're so running we're moving, while we're while we're mentally. Okay, talking so you continue that. to sniff. You're moving around. You're not at a full sprint because you got to keep on the scent. Right. You're moving through. I want to make sure Toad doesn't fall off. <laughs> as you're walking, 
And you uh, continue to, to track through. I, I will let you, if you want to keep talking as you're moving through, as you're continuing to hunt through, I'll give you some time to talk. I'll keep an eye out for dangerous as well. Okay. What What should I call you? Uh, my name is Toad. You didn't meet Winger, did you? No. Hmm. Not, not anybody by that name that I know of. I told you Winger's, well, Winger's gone. Uh, I had to ask. Yeah, you did. Mm-hmm. So as you're uh, traveling through the forest, on the scent, kind of figure out what's going on here with what, what it is. Right? Who, who, how shall I refer to all of you? Oh, uh, you call me uh, Brother Blue Fox. My name's Flash. Mm-hmm. Great, because you're fast. Mm-hmm. That's good. Yeah. Eh. You can you call mean? me Fern and Fern? Fernie. Fern? That's what I'm known as. Are you from here. a gully? Just checking. <laughs> Fern, Fern of the gully, yes. Oh, okay. Got it. Yes. So we got Toad, Brother, just Brother Fox or Brother? Sure. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Flash and Fern. And we've got a witch hunter to kill. Yes. Yeah, witch hunter to kill. Before. Well, we don't necessarily need to kill him. We just need to take his eyes and get the head back. Oh, we could take his eyes and just leave him alive. I think I'd like to do that, actually, now that you put that in my head. Yeah. As you guys are talking, you suddenly notice as a badger jumps out in the middle of, the, of the, your uh, pathway. <laughs> badger! Yeah. Hey. What are you doing in my territory? As he gets up, he's just, just like just snarling. You can see his big teeth. Get out of here! We don't have time to deal with you right now, badger! Get out of here! Go away! We're, we're looking for a witch hunter. I don't know a witch hunter, but you're in my spots. Fine, we'll leave. We're going. We're good. We're good. We'll keep going. <laughs> Get yeah, out of the way. As you're trying to go around him, he like sidesteps around. Go back. Badger, there's no, like. Oh, we can't. Why? Us I'm tracking a witch hunter. <laughs> witch hunter? Yeah. Mm, you're those witches' things, aren't you? Yeah. yeah. Familiars. We're called familiars. Yeah, whatever. Witches things. I don't care. You're still animals and you're still in my spot. He watches. He lifts his tail up and a big stream of piss just comes right out of it as it hits one of the sides of the tree. So, uh, see? Dude, you're That gross. means go away. We're moving through it. We're just gonna, we're just gonna get right by you and we'll keep on going. No trouble. Mm, no trouble necessary. Go around. Everyone. We might lose the trail if we go around. I can't understand this thing, but it seems like it's not moving. We should kill it. We should kill it and keep moving. Badger. I bear my fangs. You don't want it Let us go through. Are you gonna try to? Are you gonna try to outfierce it? Yeah, I'm gonna try to outfierce it. Okay, roll fierce. It's a badger, so it's challenging. It's an eight. I'm gonna fierce too. And a seven. Not quite. What'd eight. you get? Eight. Yeah, we're equally fierce. <laughs> okay, so you watch as the. Well, I gotta roll mine. Oh, I'm sorry. It's just a challenge. I just force you to roll dice. That's right. <laughs> Uh, it's not about me rolling dice, it's about forcing you to roll dice. So you watch as the badger backs on like, my, as he continues to kind of backpedal a little <laughs> bit. Let us through. <laughs> uh, if you're going to find that witch hunter, he's already gone. He hopped on his horse. I thought you said you didn't know him. Yeah, well, I lied. <laughs> you can't you to go Typical back. badger. <laughs> As he watches, he kind of pedals up against the back of a tree. As I walk past him. Is it the tree that he pissed on? on and now he has pee on himself? Good. (laughs) I'm kicking dirt on him. You know Good. (laughs) He takes a swipe at you. Make it quick. Make it quick. (laughs) What'd you get? Three. (laughs) All right, he swaps you. For a uh, for a little bit of a uh, little bit of fox blood damage, go, taking a take another danger. Yeah, you yipe, yipe, as you uh, um, as you continue to barrel past his pathway, uh, continuing up along the trail. Um, as you can you see along the scent, you can see where a horse was uh, clearly tied off, and you can smell the horse that's in this area too. And you can definitely see along the trail that he is uh, he has taken off to a full gallop. Uh, okay. Yeah. Oh, so you want to keep keep going? Absolutely. Let's follow yeah, this yeah, horse. Follow we got to do it. Okay. So, uh, Wait, you, is it on a main road? Dogs and foxes. It's on, a, it's, it's on a, a hunting trail. Okay. But as you start going through it more and and start continuing to go closer to closer, you you come across a worn traveling trail that's okay. definitely, you basically come out of the forest into the surrounding farmlands, which okay. encompasses a large trail, and you can see there's actually several carts and buggies that um, gonna, are moving along the trail. Stay skirted in the woods. Right. People so as you come to the outskirts of the woods, you can see as the kind of the tree line breaks, and you can see some rolling farmland oh. with several carts with merchants just 
just you can see them just moving in a blind way along the trails. A couple of them are, you know, donkeys with carts filled with stuff. Some of them are walking along, keeping their oxen at pace. But it's it's a actually a pretty busy trail. You seem to be at a crossroads of sorts. I ask one of the oxen, hey, you seen a witch hunter come past here? Probably had a head with him. <clears throat> he kind of like gives you this look like, mm, as he continues walking away, acknowledging you, but ignoring you. You can see me, buddy. <clears throat> as he continues to walk <laughs> by. <laughs> Flash has the trail, let's just get on it. I still have the trail, still right? Him? Yeah, Flash got the trail, right? <laughs> yeah. Let's go, what are we doing? What? We keep go we, I've got the trail still, right? You've got the trail still. I've got the scent. Uh, well, and horses are even more pungent than humans. So right. So this is you're now to pick to up the scent here with all these new scents around. Yeah. You're now at a little bit of a challenging task rating. So let's roll an eight. Okay. Up to to which again? To clever. Um. To cleric. Yes. Okay. Oh. No, I need a Benny. Can I use a Benny in? This? Oh yeah. Oh, Benny's, Benny's in this. So Benny's in this game. Um. It's a good boy. A Benny will raise your die result by one. Oof. Yeah. I, I only rolled a three total. That with, sucks. We lost the trail. Yeah. So I'd be five Bennies. But we don't want to lose the trail. Which way? Wait, wait, wait. What wait, do we wait, know wait. about this town? So uh, that's good. Why don't you roll uh, clever? And that's simple. So six. Okay. Let's let's all pull our resources all here. Us? What do you all know about the town? Oh, I got a ten. You got a ten. I got a seven. Great. Um, I'm, I'm going to take this opportunity to say, brother, hold still, wait, and I'm going to jump on him from Flash oh. onto his to his smaller but very muscular back <laughs> and make my way to his badger wound. And I'm going to try to use my magic, which is tidy, clean, and mend, to oh. try to heal yeah. you. That's that's simple. That's simple. Yeah. Oh, that's how you do it. Okay. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Why don't you roll? Why don't you roll sly with that? Sly. It is good that you have friends that care about you it so is. much. I appreciate it. I rolled a nine. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, you're here. So he watches <laughs> his little toady, toady tongue la, 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 licks up uh, on him a little bit, and uh, yeah. yeah, that's um Actually feels better. pretty pretty antiseptic. Mm -hmm. um, I comb his fur very neatly and tidy with your with your put, little put toady legs. Back yeah. The way that it was. Yep. Yeah. Thank you, too. And then hop back over to Flash's back. You're an, uh, mm -hmm. uh, if you're clear of any infection, <laughs> right. unless you start rolling and shit. Do I lose a danger point? Or? Uh, no, 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 that's <laughs> good. No, 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 no. Is it, what is the way that we keep track of health, or is that not that important? It's, it's health is not important. Uh, okay. It's only danger points. If you okay. ever roll, if you ever roll under your danger point, you're, it's kind of like you're, you're in a very bad situation mm. which could lead to death. Mm. Mm. So. I see. What do I know about this town? What do you know about this town? Mm. Good question. Um, it is Hollerton, all right? It is a, it is a farming community that is uh, actually built around a wizard's college. Is it called Hogwarts? No, it's Hollerton. <laughs> What's it called? Hollerton. Okay. Yes, the city is called Hollerton and the, uh, the academy is, is called the... Um, well, the Hammerton School of Magical Arts. The Hollerton <laughs> Academy of Magical Arts. Hammerton. Sorry, Hammerton. Hammerton in the midst of Hollerton. Who named <laughs> Hammerton? <laughs> Ivan, right Me, now on the top right of the head. <laughs> <laughs> so the town's Hollerton. <laughs> I love this. The town is Hollerton, and the school is Hammerton. Yes. Academy of Magical Arts, so Ballerton. Um, so uh, What's you do know it's it's centered, and so and you can tell what it is is because it's very easy to see the magical college because it has three very distinctly large towers centered around a large stone wall that seems to have an outlooking outcrop. The farmlands around it are essentially the the agriculture that supports the town and the surrounding area. Uh, there is a lordling duke who is Lord. purveyor of this land that is very, very far away and nowhere near where Hollerton is, but there is a mayor who looks over Hammerton. There's a mayor that looks over Hollerton 
and there is a headmaster. Headmaster that looks <laughs> that over here. Why did you do that to yourself? <laughs> <laughs> because I am sadistic. Uh, Masochistic. <laughs> Masochistic. Uh, quit delivering them cookies. Hey, what? um, What's the story with those? So Toad's Toad's out. You know. Uh, <laughs> that's about as much as you know at the moment. It is a it is a pretty sprawling town. It is not huge, uh, but there is. It's large enough that there is a, like a supporting economy inside of there, in which a large amount of people do trade often and frequently there. It's not a small town. But it's not a sprawling metropolitan as well either. Damn it, you guys. Damn it, we lost him. And this is not a small town. It's not a metropolis. You remember it's the not scent? Not a small though, town. Right? You remember the scent? You remember the scent? You remember the scent? I remember the scent. He remembers the scent. We can find him again. We can just sniff around until I find it. Wait, 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 wait. Thought, 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 thought. How does this town and the wizards in the town feel about witches? Um. They. They actually, they got. A, they actually have a good repertoire. Okay. There's a little bit of a like um this necessary evil hmm. kind of relationship. Okay. Um, they don't trust them. Hmm. Do they respect but, their magic though? But they, but they fear and respect their magic mostly because they always come into defense when there's other raiders or bandits in the area. Uh, also, the fact that it's just the the, the townspeople. The wizards and the witches spend a lot of money in the town. Okay. And so it's always kind of those things where the the uh, academy not only provides kind of luxury goods in their own little unique way, but they also feed into the economy. And so as a result, people who also come into the town in order to obtain these luxury goods, they bring a lot of traffic into um, Oligarchy. Hollerton as well, too. So... Uh, does that make sense? Yes. Can we inquire around town amongst the local local critters? Well, that would you involve you the... having to get into the town first. And as yeah. I mentioned, there is a nice stone ten foot wall that's currently dividing you and the people inside of there. Oh. Where's the gate? The gate. There is a gate, and it's leading into the town, and it seems to be well guarded. Uh, We're animals. They they won't care. Is there a cart or something that I could possibly secrete myself on? Because foxes are never really. Uh, I thought true. the toad would be the one to secrete anything on this. <laughs> not, uh, like secrete is in secret. Type. What's the word secret. for you? Secrete. Secure. Sneak. Hide. Sneak, sneak onto. <laughs> Sneak creep. Are you are you trying <laughs> to hop into the uh, or, uh, into like, like a run. trading cart, so to speak? Yeah, or like the, the axle of a of a cart. Yeah, is anything we can ride in on. Yeah, there is drive. there is plenty of carts. So if you would like to slyfully yes. try to hop into one of the rising carts, you're welcome to it. I'm also gonna stop betraying me. <laughs> <laughs> oh wow. What's the difficulty? Uh, the difficulty for this is difficult because you need to make sure that you are not seen you I as you hop <laughs> into this thing. Um, so we're going to call it challenging with an eight. Eight. Well, I don't have to roll because I'm riding Flash. So right. Good luck, Flash. Get, in. On, get on that card. I'm good. I'm on You're in? Mm -hmm. Great. Okay. That's I got a 12. It? So I basically Flash, just like hop in and just stroll okay. on. That, that's what Nobody I mean. sees me. Huh? Into the cart? Yes. Great. So I'm you. Just, Quick like a bunny, uh, hop, yeah. hop, hop, and then leap into a uh, basically a, a, a various form of sacked goods. <laughs> um, you can feel them rolling around. Maybe there were potatoes, great or squash. I, mean, together, I grab a snack. <laughs> you're all in the same card. If, if if unless you're trying to all go for different cards, please tell me if you're trying to do different cards. I'm not yeah. trying to even go for the card. He's not I have for cards. Zero sly. Great. So, so you're just like a stray dog. Yeah, I'm a dog. Street. I'm gonna walk up. Actually, I'm gonna walk right up to one of the guards and go. Okay. And then point, like I'm a pointer, and point to the inside of the town. <laughs> All right, uh, that's still... Just to still... avoid any confusion from a human, I'm going to leap from Flash's back onto the cart with the rest of my friends. With your team. Menagerie. Right. So We're a menagerie! So the, the human doesn't... <laughs> But there's it a toad is. on it. Back. You got it. So all three of you are in a cart. If uh, Flash is walking up to the the, the door, mm -hmm. uh, so Flash, you get there first because it, it is a tired old mule that is pulling this squash cart at the moment as uh, as it's going along the road. And you come up to you and you see the dog. Uh, you can see as you walk up and you see the guard standing there with with his halberd, as you know, there's a little. 
He's, he's got he's got the small personnel door that's sitting among the two gates, and then mm -hmm. for big carts he obviously opens up and lets people in. But you can see there is a there is a working queue to get into the city. So there's about four or five other carts that are attempting to get through in there at the moment. And you can see one gentleman has a slate, like a slate that he clears and writes on to as he's walking. Um, into each cart, talking with the merchants and writing items down into the cart. Uh, I burrow into one of the sacks of potatoes. Yeah, I want to get deep in there, so let's go. You're going to try to get in the potatoes? No, right just, the just make sure. The whole point was to be hidden in the cart. Right, Actually, got it. Yeah, okay. So uh, you can see as the, the guard goes, hey, oi, hey, get out of here, get, get. You watch as he attempts to like, kick, like, like, uh, like make a couple of jabs at you like he's trying to scare you away. <laughs> oi. Hey, no stray dogs in the town. Get out of here. Get. Do I have a collar from the witch, maybe? No. Dang it. Hey, yeah. big guy, make a run for it. <laughs> hey, yeah, uh, I mean, try to try to cozy up with one of the uh, with one of the merchants, like you're the merchant's dog. You guys aren't there. You're in hiding in the back. You said we had a we had tele 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 uh, Ah, foiled by your own rules. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, telepathic link. All right. So, <laughs> are you getting away from the guard? Are you gonna well, keep... yeah, I'm gonna. I'm gonna. If, if a guard takes his yeah, halberd, like, I'm gonna <laughs> get out. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna do the old dog move and like you know jump back. All right. Um, you can watch as you all three are like lining up in the queue. But you know what? Look, I'm a dog, right? Yeah. And he does that. Yeah. Like when my when if 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 uh, I'm my dog doesn't want me to put a collar on him when it's time to go for a walk. Uh huh. Bites my dog him. does this thing all the time, by the way, where he comes and tells me it's time to go for a walk. Yeah. And then as soon as I get the the leash out, he it's runs away. I'm right. like, what are you doing? <laughs> anyway, so like if he wants to get around me, he can just get around me. So yeah. I'm just gonna if he's doing this, yeah. I'm just gonna go. do a move. Make a run for it. Make run a run for it. Yeah. All right, let's make a quick check. Yeah. All right, check, baby. All right. Um, quick is this is the door shut for the record. Oh, <laughs> oh dang I mean, it! You well, what about around. the gate where the where the where the uh... that is that is open ever so slightly. If okay, you that's want. where I'm making the run for. All right, then make an eight. This is challenging. We need more than one. Yeah, yeah. yeah. ten actually. Nine plus my quick. All right. So, so as he's going, get saw it. get out of here. <laughs> get get. You bolt around. <laughs> yeah, as you it. circle around and get in through the main gate, as you watch as one of the guards like attempts to body tackle you <laughs> as he as he slams himself into <laughs> under the front and you bolt into town. Yeah, I can totally see my dog doing that too. It's a <laughs> dog thing to do. What does a telepathic link entail? Can we see what the No, you can just can talk see? to each other. I so made it in, guys, I made it in. I'll see you on the other side. <laughs> Find an alleyway or something to hide in. Yeah, that's I I run to to the nearest whatever it looks like a dog can hide on. All right, you uh, you that's good because as you're as you're basically um getting up as the guy runs around, he points to other guards like, "Get that dog! Get him out of here! He may have diseases." As he, they continue to just run, and you see a couple of guys running after this hound dog in the midst of an alleyway. As you bolt in into a into an alley. Good job on creating the distraction, man. We'll get we'll get back to you. So as as you can see, you. It takes time because your cart basically packs um, behind you. I need to probably turn off the roaring fire that I've been having on here for a while um, and put on my... Town sounds. Town sounds. Town sounds. Um, so, sounds like the jungle. I don't know. <laughs> oh, it's a summer day. Okay. Uh, so you, uh, you continue to kind of just watch as, like, there's a gentleman with tiny... Uh, the spectacles um, down onto the bridge of his nose as he's wiping slates as he seems to be going up to each mission going, yes, what are you declaring? And the merchants go, oh, I've got four pounds of potatoes and 53 pounds of squash. Yes, and where is it from? Billiton. Good, good, good. Um, and he you s begin to Bullerton to Hollerton. Bullerton and Hollerton and Hammerton, yes. Uh, yeah, as you watch as the man continues to look under the axle, and you see as he as he nods to both of his uh, compatriots and they start rifling through the bags and the uh, stuff around them. Um, you watch as one of the men opens up the bag and sees you, sir, <laughs> in the midst of it, and goes, Oi! <laughs> Not even waiting, hopping out and running for the game. <laughs> no, 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 okay, make a, make a quick check. Open, man. 
Um, Come on! <laughs> make a quick check. Six. Bet you can bet no. Yes, two bennies. Two bennies? Yes. All right. Get two bennies gets it for you. <laughs> All right. So uh, you watch as he grasps the back of your neck mm-hmm. and lifts you up as you try to lift out, but you <laughs> bite onto his arm as he Oy! lifts his hand snap up. At, not bite snap it. at it. Yeah. You snap at it, but he drop scaringly, uh, in a scared way, drops you as you scamper out mm-hmm. from the side of it. And um, what are you two doing? Oh, I'm doing my best to look like a potato. <laughs> I probably can have an easier time looking like an actual potato. So. <laughs> <laughs> Curl real good and hide. Uh, then let's do Sly for both of you then. This is, again, challenging. So we're looking at an eight. Oh, wow. Killing the game. Oh, Over yeah. I'm uh, such a potato, somebody almost picks me up and bites into me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm that convincing. Um, I have burrowed my way into a potato and I have it like around my face. Yeah, you're in there. I am in there. I am in a potato. I'm such a potato. <laughs> All right. Well, I am a potato. You watch as the inspector. Tiny potato? Furry potato. Tiny potato. Tiny, tiny furry, furry potato. potato. <laughs> <laughs> Look at you, tiny potato. Look at Erica being a tiny potato amongst the tiny potatoes. Or the large potatoes, I would say. It was a good year for potatoes. Good year. Um, okay. uh, but. Uh, uh, and Toad, Toad, you you can see as the as the men who are looking at the cars goes, Oh, clear, Inspector! As you watch as he tightens it up and goes, It can go through! And you watch as the Inspector looks and goes, All right, get on through! As uh, the cart makes its way into town, leaving only our sullen fox on the other side. No, I slipped through, I was running through the gate. Uh, if you want to go through the gate, that's a different check, sir. Yeah, I was going through the gate. I was not. I was going to get loose and go through the gate. Well, no, you got out of the grasp of the gentleman okay. going to reach after Heading you. Heading for the gate immediately. Right. That's. I'm sorry to say that is difficult. I understand. You are a fox. I am a fox. Because you're looking at a nine. <laughs> you, you might need to get another dice. <laughs> what? What? Uh, what was the? Yeah. What is it? What's your quick? My quick is one. one. So you rolled a four total. Mm. That's so you five. Have five. Do we have five bennies in there? Have we gotten any subscribers yet? <laughs> no, no, right? <laughs> you, if you spend five, you'll have four left. Oh, then you spend five. Yeah. Okay. Okay, sure. Give me time. You can't keep holding us up, <laughs> Hey, I'm, I'm, I'm more clever than I am. Do we get a? Um, do we have a subscriber sound? Uh, don't ask me. Have we had any subscribers? I don't think Denise. so. Denise! Let's, let's, let's not. Let's wait to ask that. So if it happens, it happens. Right. But we uh, need it. We need it. Uh, until then, you'll deal with your four bennies. Right. All right. Okay. In the situation. Mm-hmm. All right. Um, where goes that, then? Uh, as you all scamper into town, you find various places to duck into and hide uh, the telepathic link with Flash. I'm <laughs> presuming allows you to all kind of meet up in the alley. It is midday, by the way. Okay. Uh, it is very much bright out. Mm-hmm. Now there is a bunny, a fox, a dog, and a toad sitting amongst a dirty alleyway. As you watch people moving around, and you can see a couple of guards are looking, seem to be looking around for you. I'm gonna find some mud. Okay. And roll myself in it to disguise my bright. <laughs> oh, your bright <laughs> fur. <laughs> Um, it is a wonderful summy summer dry day. There is has not recently rained, and but we're in an alleyway. There's got to be some. Mud you're in the there. alleyway. There's Aww. there's there's like there's garbage. Got to do what we got to do, bro. Like a cobblestone alleyway. There's there's it's Where's lined it? with the co- there's cobblestone along the street, but not the alleyways. Okay, no. so there's like dry dirt. It's dry dirt. Mm. No right. garbage anywhere to uh, wet garbage anywhere to. Mm, let me see. Is there a little sweater made just for a fox nearby? A little sweater? Yeah. A little tiny, you know, <laughs> Christmas sweater? Good, so you hey, know what yeah. I'm hey, talking about. Hey, you. I, I bet you could slime on him and he could roll around the dirt. It'll make mud. Make your own mud. What are you trying to do, brother? This oh, guy yeah, yeah, I'm very bright. Oh, I don't uh, right, not it is, um, it is a surprisingly own. clean... Alleyway. All the alleyways. In yeah. This is a really nice town. Collerton, and you picked the clean one. 
Hey, I was trying to get away. So Did you see I. the size of those halberds? Yes. I was almost in the middle of one. <laughs> okay, then. All right, we're going to, we're going to, we're going to, we're going to. We're all pretty well hidden at the moment. There is, even though, if, even if it's not filled with dirt and trash, there are definitely a couple of stone staircases you can hide behind right. in order to. Uh, cool. Let's just hide. Let's just yeah. hide. Not any fear of discovery cool. at the moment. Okay. Are there any rats around then? You want to go That's hunting critters. for rats? Yeah. We gotta oh, yeah, ask some figure questions. out what the yeah. yeah we need How about you uh, make us local towns? Yeah, get the townies, local get the townies let's do a creatures. let's do a clever let's do a simple clever check. That means six. Uh, five. And five five as well. See if I can find any rats. I found the rats. <laughs> oh, you oh. Well, Eight. she said she was specifically looking for rats. Was that all of you as well? Oh, yeah. yeah. I figured I could really find some yeah. locals to talk to. Okay. And what about Toad? I'm not doing anything right. Right. Okay. Sorry. Let me know. I mean, if, if she's job. declaring for it, uh, right. piggybacking actions are fine, but you just need to tell me. Okay. okay piggybacking. Hey, well, I right. failed. Did you find anybody? I uh, Find anybody? So you what, you rolled. You rolled, You succeeded. Yes. Okay. So I got an eight. I actually, did two above. Both of you. Um, Thank God I'm good for something. <laughs> so uh, uh, both of you are kind of trying to peek ahead out, look around as you're sniffing through the various uh, cobblestones and alleyways. Um, fox, you here. That's a brother fox to you. One more time. Brother fox. <laughs> brother fox. You, brother you hear the sounds of scurrying with your acute ears, and you realize that it's actually on the roof. So you have to bound up to the top of the roof before you can actually hear anything. And you hear the sound of a rat as you watch as a slimy little tail ducks its way into the 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 space between two like brick roof tiles. So uh, excuse me. <laughs> you hear you hear a little shriek. I mean you know harm. <laughs> Liar! You yes. fox! Just get away! Stay where you are. Let's just talk. <laughs> I'm not coming after you. You're gonna eat me. I'm not gonna I, eat you. I, I need your help. Uh, you can you can, can hear I, him talking okay, from up at the top. I, I bound up with him and I say, "Hey, uh, if you're gonna bound up, you're a, you are not a climbing hare, bunny." Oh, I'm pretty quick. Yeah, you're quick, but you're not a climber. So let's make some let's make a quick check. That's hard climb, for you. Climb is under quick. What's that? Climb is under quick. Climb is under quick. That's what I said. Yeah. Let's make okay. a quick check for you, but it's challenging. That's an eight. Um, ten. Jesus. Okay. Seriously? I've got, I've got three quick. I mean, yeah, I'm a quick bunny. So, Bunny, you... Uh, do you want to describe it to me? Because I don't even know how to describe All this. All right. Take a look. <laughs> parkour Bunny! There you go. Parkour Pyromaniac. Parkour, parkour. <laughs> Up to the top. Bounce, bounce, bounce. And I land on his head. Seriously? Yeah. <laughs> Talk to the rat. <laughs> hey, buddy. Look. I'm hanging out in the slash's head. He's cool. We're cool, right? You're, you're cool, right? Yeah. That's right. I'm cool. Yeah. But why are you on his head? Look. To prove We're that buds. I'm not going to eat yeah. you. Yeah. Mm. We're buds. Mm. You reek of magic. You're one of those witches things, aren't you? That's right. We're one of those witches things. And our witch is dead. You ever lost someone that you cared about? Mm. Yeah, then you know what it's like. No. What? Because I didn't care. Oh my god. I'm a rat. Well, we have. We, we you have some issues you need sorted out, buddy. But hey, listen, hey, hey, hey. we so, lost somebody that's important to us, and we need some information. You ever heard about a witch hunter in this town? He watches. He like his eyes kind of dart back and forth. You know something. You know something. You know something. Uh, what's it mean to you? What do you need? What do you think? I'm a rat. Like, is guys, it, you got anything uh, he, edible down there? Any cheese or is good he pizza food? rat? <laughs> pizza rat. Another pizza rat. Um, hero. We have, we have anything hero. good down there? We could uh, we could uh, give you, our rat friend here. Uh, I look around and see if there's any food. It's, it's, in a, pretty, this it's a pretty clean alleyway. It's a clean ass town. Yeah. How do you feel about potatoes? Yeah, a little starchy. You got something cooked? Oh my god. Yeah, this guy. Look, yeah. I got a I got like 75 mouths to feed. So, <laughs> you know, unless you got something good, 
I'm gonna go on my way. All right. Brother, Ferdy, perhaps you could uh, entice this rat with the threat of not killing him. <laughs> All right. We'll try it. We'll try it the frog's way. I guess we could. Here's toad, the problem. I'm a toad, man. I miss Toad. <laughs> Here's the problem, <laughs> Mr. Rat. If you can't help me, I find myself getting hungry. He watches. He skirts back into it and goes. How far is he? He's. He, if you want to try to make a swipe for him, do a Not quick yet. check. Not yet. Not um, yet. I'm gonna go around behind him. I'm gonna hop off and go hop, hop, hop around behind him. He's in between the two tiles, okay. so he. You can see, and I and I say this is that he has a very. Wait. So there, these easy are the escape. two like overlapping tiles, yes. right? Mm-hmm. I hop onto the one on top of it. <laughs> You hop on the one on top pin, of it. Pin it down. Uh, okay, let's let's roll Something quick. Roll through. quick on it. Um, uh, yeah. 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 What are you doing? Just roll a solid Keep ten. Keep that die. Oh, this Keep guy that is so die. precious. Beautiful die. As you squish down on top of it, you watch as he like as he continues to push out. Um, <laughs> he, uh, uh, he, you're basically on top of it, and you can feel his little body trying to squeak by, and goes. Stupid. Nom, 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 so nom. you see, if you want to get back to those seventy-five mouths, you'll tell us what we need to know. Is that to, right, Mother We didn't Fox? want to do it this way. Why did you make us do this? <laughs> <laughs> what? I wasn't even doing anything. You're the ones that came and jumped in on my little space. You're all dicks. Asking you for <laughs> help, and you Are denied we? us. Ooh, ooh. Hey, hey, buddy. Let me tell you something. You're in the city. All right? I don't know what all you country folks think out there, but you gotta watch out for yourselves in this town. And you do need to watch out for yourself by helping us before I get hungry. Look, what? Okay, okay. There's a bunch of unsavories that hang out in one part of town. I don't know about any witch hunter, but I do know a place where you could probably find someone who knows. We would graciously accept your help. Okay, so. No. Looks like we got two doggies. No. I I I heard the one, so the wolf's back. So, um, it's a, it's a, it's a little, it's a little tavern. What's the tavern's name? What's the tavern's name? Is What's it, is it the Green Wyvern? Sure, it's the Green Wyver- Wyvern. <laughs> it's a, it's called the Green Wyvern. Yeah, a, I know the place. It's a, it's, you know it's, 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 it's out, uh, it, it's out Riverside. <laughs> Riverside. No one goes there. <laughs> oh, that sucks, but, you know, that's where the, that's where all the info's at. Now, can I go now? Why was it so difficult, now, was it? You better pray your information is correct, or we're coming after you and your 75 mouths. Yeah, yeah, sure, sure. He kind of Let backs go. out a little bit and scurries into the side beams as he, uh, as he runs along the, runs around. Yeah. We're trying to be nice. Yeah. <laughs> we tried. That was pretty. As long as we tried to be that's, nice, that's good, you know? Yeah. yeah. Man, who would have thought that the uh, toad was the one to be the, take the hard line, huh? <laughs> Toad's about efficiency. I like that. Yeah. <laughs> All right. I guess we better head over the green wyvern. It's on the other so, side of town. It's going to take um, some sneaking. So it's going to take some sneaking. Um Maybe. Do you want to try to do it in the middle of the day, or do you want to try to to wait until night? We got uh, a week. I know, but yeah, but we don't know where he's going or what he's doing. He could be gone. He could be. He could leave. I think we should try to do it now. I, I think so. We only got a week. He might be there right now. All right, let's go. All right, we're gonna make the attempt. We should stick like to. Should Ooh, yeah. I like that. We yeah. should stick. We should. Well, there's my voice. We should stick to alleyways as best as we can to avoid the gaze of humans. I agree. That sounds good. Yeah. You want to well, so jump back on? How are you doing on water, yes. buddy? Are you doing okay? You <laughs> doing okay? He's a toad. Goodbye. Toads don't right. as much water as frogs. Yes. Oh. Oh. Common misconception. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so you're gonna you're gonna stick to the alleyways. I'm gonna try to hop. Try to. Make some. Mm-hmm. Back on. I'm gonna say some sly movements. I'm on Flash's back. Okay, roll right. for me, Flash. I'm just on your back. <laughs> sly, are you? What's the fox? No, sly. Sly. But, you know, I could always. All right. I'll. I'll, right. I'll. Can I? Wow, can I? Well, can I like take take point and like hop around? You know. Yeah. If you want to take like, point, push, yeah, push, you're just right. making slides. You're not gonna make their checks any better, unfortunately. Okay. What's the difficulty? Uh, this is gonna be. It's basic. So sevens. Okay. 
Yeah. I thought it was a six. I saw yeah. you. I saw it. Yeah. Wasn't a six? Nope. Sorry. You can yeah. use one day. Nice. I rolled a ten. You rolled ten? Yeah. Shit. Give me a penny. Yep. Now, to be fair, for the for for the dog, you can get away with it a little better than these three can. So. Right, because I could always. Someone might think I'm just a lost pet too, right? Yeah, it depends. You just can get out of the situation a little easier than these two ten. So uh, take a danger point. Take a danger point. I took a Benny. Oh, you took a Benny? Mm-hmm. Then you're yeah. fine. Well, then the hair. Take a danger point. All right. Um, so as you're kind of darting through alleyway to alleyway, as you're kind of hopping around, you're hiding behind some rain barrels that seem to have a little, you know about halfway full or stuff. But as you're coming out. You uh, you you basically dart around and you watch as a little boy goes, "Mama, bunny!" as, she, as he runs towards you and tries to grab you by Don't your hind you legs. Touch me! <laughs> and he grabs you by your hind legs, but you kick, 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 ow! As you jumps off and goes, "That bunny, he's mean, that stupid kid." <laughs> as they as they continue to run off and you duck uh, continually through alleyway to alleyway. Eventually, making your making your way Riverside. So, um, yeah. Does the Riverside imply that there are less people? It is less crowded and congested. It is near nature and the river. No, it just means that you cross the river. Mm. That's actually where you're at. So now that you're on the bridge leading to Riverside, you have two options. You can either go along the path where there's more humans, or you can cross the river by your own devices. Oh, river is that river. Uh, it is um, not a. It's not a Mississippi. Okay. It's not even a Los Angeles River. Okay. But it is a. It is more than a brook. So it's not paved. It's not Los Angeles River. <laughs> uh, I would say that um, it is definitely. It is enough that boats can go down it. You know, but it is not enough that like a merchant vessel. Could go into it. This bridge does it have any? But like fishing, like little guys can go fishing. It could. It's, it's definitely good enough for fishing. In fact, you can see many people who do have their lines out alongside the stone bridge mm-hmm. that is currently crossing over it. So. Look like the bridge is. Uh, does it look like there's there's any under- struts or anything? Or yeah, anything you can use to. Uh, there, it doesn't. It's not wide enough that it requires struts. Is there a runoff channel for uh, rain on this bridge? Might be like a gutter. Yeah, gutter mm-hmm. might be able to run through. That's a good point. At this time for things, would it just naturally drain out or would they actually have that kind of infrastructure? Um, there is, but it's on either side of the river. So there's not one that like, for example, if you're trying to, there are spill offs, but it's just like, it's just basically little cut grooves that just dump into the water. The and the, the, the actual, bridge itself just has like a stone knot there that it could just pour off into the water in there. Looks like we're going to have to ford the river. Well, at least it's I either have. It's pretty clear that it's either fording or crossing. Mm. I think we could dart across, Eddie. Huh? All right. Yeah, let's start across it. Let's just dart. All right, let's do it. Okay. I don't Darting. need to ride on Flash's back. I will swim across myself so that perhaps... Uh, uh, Fernie can ride on Flash's back to avoid getting. So you're gonna swim? Yes, I'm gonna work. Okay. See you on the other side, buddy. So for you, this is simple. Simple. Is it's just simple? I'm not six. But is it clever for your slide quick? Um, I would say probably quick. Okay. Nice. Yeah, he's good. Ten. (laughs) <laughs> so um, let's do Toad real quick. So Toad, you whoop, and you're sitting on the back thinking about it when Toad just jumps off the back and starts swimming across. You can hear the conversation of several fish as you continue the white through the river. As, what does that sound like? Hey, hey. I roll my eyes underwater somehow. And hey, <laughs> fish. Yeah. So uh, what do you want to do today? I don't know. What do you want to do? You can't swim. Ugh. Yeah. <laughs> hey, um, you uh, you got something on your mouth there. What? Look. As you watch as a fish comes up. And <laughs> through, uh, oh, that's uh, sad. <laughs> as it's flapping through, it goes, see you later, Jim. <laughs> <laughs> I make uh, my way across underwater. Yeah. 
and I have a small body, so the current takes me far. That takes but you downstream quite a bit. It takes me downstream quite a bit. But by the time I reach the other end, mm -hmm. because it was simple and I rolled a 9 plus 1 is 10, mm -hmm. I then slowly make my way, when I'm on the rocks in the land, slowly make my way back to the origin point to meet my friends. Okay. So as you're hopping along, um, you uh, let's let's talk about our three crossing the river now. Let's get back to you. Wait, it's We're a river. There's got to be mud. <laughs> oh, yeah, there's mud. Good. Yeah. I'm going to... Reduce my uh, money. <laughs> get a little camouflage. Okay, so that you're gonna you're gonna dirty fine. up your fine fur a little bit. Yes, hopefully that'll make things a little easier. So you're all making some quick checks to get over there, and since this is uh, crossing a, a busy mm. street without causing attention to yourselves, let's make this challenging. Uh, yeah. uh. <laughs> <laughs> nice. I failed. You failed. Yeah. Oh, okay. All right. Uh, she got a nine. Eleven? Damn. Five? Damn, girl. Five. Yeah, <laughs> take yeah. a danger point. Okay. Me? Yep. Okay. <clears throat> You're doing okay. You're doing okay. So, uh, uh, as you three are crossing the river, you're going over, and a lot of you are fast enough, but you watch as one of the fishermen who has taken Jim out, and you can see he's plopped the fish down onto the bridge, and it's wiggling around, and as you're walking by, you can see as the fisherman goes, oh, get away from that! And he just kicks you right in the oh. ribs. Oh! As he runs around, don't you take my fish, you dog! As he watches, he takes the hook out from the fish and starts whacking it on the head with the fish on the head with a rock. God, isn't there like a medieval version of PETA or something? <laughs> it should be. Uh. Um, it sounds the, familiar, though. Hmm. <laughs> as, uh, also, I feel like I've been a... This is the second time I've been a dog, I feel like, but the first dog was a lot smarter than this one. <laughs> you remember, you remember, you're starting to recall, like, uh, Pugmire is in your brain, dude. Okay. You're, you know, uh, not Basil, I'm sorry. Um, Ignatius? Ignatius <laughs> Terrierton is, is his, his... That moment in your life is now, it's its less fuzzy now, and it is more clear okay. that that is an actual thing. Because I remember, as you guys are making jumps, especially the last couple jumps, those full memories are with you. Oh. It's like, it is not fuzzy anymore. You know, Wish. you know that you're jumping, and you know where you've jumped from, and all those details, it's, you're, it, we're, we're like full quantum leap now. Okay. Oh. All right? So if we were talking to each other, then would we be talking as... How or alphas or yeah, you would oh. yeah. As you're talking to each other, you're talking essentially about your 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 alpha personalities because these familiars didn't really have personalities; they were animals. Well, that's good information. Yeah. So oh. okay, you know, you're basically <laughs> talking as your alphas, <laughs> but as dogs and cats, or not cats, toads and foxes. Yes. And foxes. Oh, and foxes. well, that changes yeah. things. Is your character your character still pretty frog-like then? No, not at all. <laughs> Very much like has a Spanish accent. It's a totally different. Great. But you're still a frog. That's true. That's you're right. still a toad. Yep. You know, which is fine. It's 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 how he's expressing himself at the moment. But it, as with anything, all of your alpha personalities are embedded inside of these characters. Okay. So, yeah. you know? so this is really part of a bigger picture. I'm realizing <laughs> now, guys, mm -hmm. at this moment, because whatever's happening. You know, it's 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 like things were set in motion for us to to capture this guy and, and get him and take revenge. I don't know what the what that bigger picture is, but I feel like we we've, we've got to do this. Could the witch hunter be Thanatos? It's possible. Hope not. And perhaps the witch is the thing that can get us to our next yeah jump. Thanatos. Mm. That name. Hope mentioned it. I know that name. It's not a good name. Or not a particularly bad but not a helpful name to us. What do you know of <laughs> the name? I knew but I I can't remember. We are still traveling forward as we have this conversation. Right, uh, after the dog got kicked in the ribs, but unfortunately Toad while talking, your uh, question was interrupted by a small boy picking you up. <laughs> 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 it's a toad. Ooh. How old is this boy? <laughs> he's a he's fourteen. Okay. Yeah. No, that's not good. Oh look, 
<laughs> he starts carrying by and is like, look, 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 I found a toad. As he comes I, I over to his friend. To, to urinate right now. <laughs> <laughs> uh, make it clever. Make it simple clever check. Clever? <laughs> just to see if he drops you. To urinate, it's a clever. <laughs> well, to see if the urinate does anything. Bam. Yep. Uh, that is a seven. Every <laughs> spongy just spray. Just a basic urination. <laughs> As you start peeing all over the boy's hand, he goes, Oh, gross! Starts wiping his hands on his jacket. Oh, that toe pooped on me! <laughs> gross! As you hop along. Oh, I feel bad for that boy. Get out of He's going to have a tough life. <laughs> he just wrote frog pee on Oh boy. <laughs> As you hop along to meet up with your friends. Um, hey, you hey. smell weird. <laughs> you okay? Yeah. Everything, everything okay? Anything? Yeah, I urinated. <laughs> hey. Good. Better out than it, I always say. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Where are you hiding at? <clears throat> I, I thought we were heading towards uh, trying to find the wyvern. Yeah, I mean, um, if you guys are walking out on the street, that's fine. Just no, 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 you no, tell no, me what's up. Looking for an alleyway. Right, so as you're crossing the street, right, you're looking so we're for an alleyway. Right, so we're making our way to the wyvern. Right. The green, uh, wyvern. The green, the green wyvern. wyvern. I'm going to keep I'm gonna keep forcing you to make rolls if that's the case. So this is going to be another quick one as you're getting as you're getting <gasps> basically from the bridge to an alleyway. Because there's lots of humans, guys. Fail again. Take a danger point. No. I have a man 10 passes. Wait, it's simple? Yeah. It is simple. simple. Okay. What is it? Is, this is a slide. Quick. A oh, quick? Oh, you need two. Two bennies. You want to use two bennies? Oh, I keep using all these bennies. Okay. Uh, before uh, we Take move Take a danger forward. point. But I don't want to keep getting danger points either. That's okay. Before we move forward, uh, before we leave the river entirely after I urinated, mm -hmm. I'm going to slowly, I'm going to quickly jump back into the uh, river till mm -hmm. about waist high yeah. to clean myself off. <laughs> And then hop off of that and make sure that I'm clean. Then jump on Flash's back. Okay. I'll continue Thank riding you for him. that. I appreciate that. Of course. So uh, beyond just the little muddy spots that you got in there, uh, you guys dart through the alleyway. But you see, um, you see, is uh, a couple of men point and goes, "Oh my God! Look at that filthy creature! Oh, what is that? Is that shit all over it? So oh, someone call the guard. Kill that thing." As you, uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> as you dart into the alleyway, and you dart into the alleyway, and um, hair, uh, as you kind of poke your your head out to the side because they didn't notice you, you can see as this kind of uh, more sophisticated looking man who looks like that he probably shouldn't be on this side of Riverside anyway. Is hmm. basically like he seems to be trying to to like track down a guard somewhere at the moment. Let's get out of here. <laughs> yeah, but does he look like a person of interest to us? Like, why would that m more affluent person be down in the slums? Uh, that is a that is a good question. So I take a good, long, hard look at him and try to remember, so I can remember his face. Why don't later. you give him a whiff too? Get a scent. Oh yeah. Okay. So you get a scent of him. Uh, he smells of um, distilled lilacs and um, fresh linens. Aww. <laughs> And uh, okay. with a with a very pungent scent that is kind of ambrosic. Hmm. Ambrosia. Yeah, like uh, like um, I'm trying to think of the right term for it. The, the 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 stuff that people use to distill basically whale oil to make into perfume. Ambergris. Ambergris. Oh. That's distinctly <laughs> ambergris. Um, okay. <laughs> thank you. Not ambrosia. Uh, ambrosia to food of the gods, but ambergris is. And a '70s band, band. ambrosia. <laughs> there you go. And right. a salad. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, you get a good scent of him. You can see that he's. You can see he's got a hanky in there, and he definitely is trying to flag down a guard. But people don't seem to be paying him much attention at the moment. You also see that he seems to be having a, a bigger guy with him. It seems to be his. You bodyguard. Know, yeah, of sorts. Attaché. There's also what a... What if his bodyguard was named Ambrosia? <laughs> That's fine. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Ambrosia. You can also see that he is walking out from a um, from a carriage at the moment, and when he pointed out to you, it was because he was walking out from his black carriage leading into uh, an establishment somewhere. Mm. You got that dandy's number. I got it. Anybody else in the, the carriage? Set. 
Uh, no one else is in the carriage. Uh, you can see that as you're walking by that he's in a pawn shop. And you're on a one th- oh. one the corner is a pawn shop and the one the one right next is called the Green Wyvern. So you're oh, actually right next door to the Green Wyvern. Ah. All right. Pawn shop. Maybe Looks, times uh, are tough for Mr. Dandy. Mr. Dandy. <laughs> Let's see. I like it. I like it. Uh, is there a scalable rooftop situation going on with this? Yeah, with the amicable quick check, there's uh, always a way to the top of the please, roof. Please. 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 All right. <laughs> Let's do this, huh? I'm going up. Nope. <laughs> you got a new die. <laughs> Are you all going up there? Parkour, parkour. Yes. You're all. I'm also going to okay. hop up there. Up. Um, the dogs are going to be a lot. A dog getting up on the roof is going to yeah. be a lot. All right. Harder. You know what? I'll just chill down at the bottom okay. because you're right. There's no point since we can Telepathic. talk. You said it was challenging. Telepathic. Oh yeah, and for a frog, I'm even going to say that's difficult. Mm. That what you rolled? No, yeah, that's what I wrote. Uh, I'm also uh, going to stay down. Okay. Hang <laughs> on Flash's I'm back. Up. Hair's up. Uh, so you there... hopped up to... Uh, up there, do you guys? want to tell me how you hopped up? Uh, yeah, so I, uh, I I do a floop, 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 floop up through the alleyway. Um, the whole time, I every time I hit a point, I go, parkour, 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 parkour. <laughs> Oh, okay. pyromaniac. So uh, you could like <laughs> jump onto um, a trash can that then like leads up to the to the side of the wall that would lead to the other side of the alleyway, yeah. like the which then lets you up to like your to the gutter up into the top yeah. of the roof. Are there are there any uh, skylights or or windows? What do I? See? No, no skylights uh, in the pawn shop. There is definitely chimney stacks, and um, you can actually see on top of the pawn shop there is uh, appears to be a man in bundled clothing. Sleeping along the side of a smoking chimney stack at the moment. He's not moving, he, but you can see as his like soft breathing as his body lifts up and down from his rags. That's unusual. Hey, it's warm up there next to the stack. Yeah. Huh. Um, and uh, yeah, I mean you're on the roof. You're on the roof. All right. Who's what? What is the what does the guy look like? Right now, he looks, he looks like a bundle of rags. Can I rifle through his belongings? <laughs> you gotta wake him up. Yeah, you can rifle through his belongings. He does seem to have, like, a small, dirty bag. What's in the bag? Make a slide uh, Clever, 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 clever. Oh, clever. Mm. Like oh, oh, I have no idea. Uh. There might not even be a bag as far as I'm concerned. <laughs> All right, so like you, start, you start... You see no bag. <clears throat> Doesn't look like anything to me. <clears throat> uh, so you, uh... You basically stick your head in the bag and see if your little bunny ears are folded down so that you can stick your head in there and rummage through. And as you're looking around, you're seeing some, you know, you're seeing a cup, like an empty bowl, like a mug, some loose coin, a book. Uh, and then you suddenly feel a hand grasping the back of you at the moment, grabbing both of your legs as you feel lifted up as you see a toothless or single tooth hobo with a big grizzly beard looking at you and goes, <laughs> Oh, someone's getting rabbit stew tonight. No! Oh, I kick out with one leg at the one tooth. <laughs> uh, you're going to have to be fierce for oh. this. Oh, no. Oh, boy. No! Mm. Not uh, good. Take a danger point. Actually, you're gonna theoretically you're taking two danger points. Have you ever rolled under your danger at no. this point? Okay. So we have we, uh, and that says you can lower your danger by solving or running away from your problems. What does that mean? Oh yeah, so you're solving. Um, so uh, yeah, that means if by if you solve a problem or run away from it, then you could lower the danger of the situation. So, so what is your current danger at the moment? Mine is three. Yours three? Yeah. Okay. Well, keep in mind moving forward that if you manage to escape a nasty situation, like what. The hair is in at the moment. <laughs> then we'll lower the danger a little bit. Cool. So you failed though. Yes. All right. So then add a danger point. Okay. As you are holding on to the man, you're kicking out wildly, flipping around, but the man. <laughs> oh, buddy. Right. I'm making another roof attack. Okay. He he um he kind of like grabs your back as if he's going to break your back. I'm making another. I roof try attack. to set him on fire. Yeah. All right. Um, we'll do that. Also, make your roof attempt. <laughs> make your roof attempt. Ooh. I know that the hair is in danger at the moment, Good. but oh, Fox made it up. Yes. <gasps> no. 
Jesus jumped up. Did you roll under your danger? I did. I did. <laughs> you did? Okay, so come back up. Uh, you're Please up on top. Uh, <laughs> I will let you. I will let you make one attempt to save her before he snaps her back. Okay. Um, I am going to open. Wait, wait. No, I'm gonna uh, bump it. He's got. He's got. Uh, what do you call it? Achilles tendons. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, you can go up. I mean, fierce. If you're doing that, like yeah. going going after his ankles. Yeah. Yeah. Uh-huh. From behind, not from the front, because from uh, the he's, front. He's, he's the bunny went up the same point too, so he's holding him at the, up at the moment. Right, but just, you can he's 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 looking at the rabbit. Not going for the ankle. Moment. What is the what is the difficulty here? <laughs> this is basic. Basic. Uh, let's, let's let's give me one Benny. Oh, I gotta see you. Thank you. I gotta see you. you. Yeah. Yeah. All right, paint the picture for me. Okay. All right. So I, uh, so I, 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 I see him I'm about to reach against the because he grabs her back. I lunge for him and I'm going for his ankle, but I don't quite get it, and I actually just scrape along the side of him, which gives him enough to, you know, he kind of, he kind of kicks me out, but it distracts him enough that he might lose his grip on the bunny, and I'm gonna growl at him afterwards to see if he can get him to lose his grip. So on he the bunny. dropped like, one of his. Bloody fox. He dropped, uh, he dropped one of his hands to look at you, hair, at the moment as he's looking at you or looking at the fox and going. What are you doing? Oops, we got, Ooh, got a Benny. Yeah. Thank you, subscriber. Yeah. <laughs> 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 we're going through those things. What are you doing up here? Get away! Get away! He like is Ooh, trying to shoot another one. Another one. Yep. Or is that the same one? No, it's two. Shut up. Oh. There's actually two uh, that for some reason didn't trigger it. So cool. they, they happened a few minutes ago. But oh, oh. more Benny. Thank you. Shoot! Get away! Get away! As he's kicking away with his foot, I'm gonna keep running around his ankles and trying to trip him up so he's not paying attention to her. I'm gonna. Try and set him on fire. All right, roll it. What what is that? Uh, uh, you're at a. That's. I mean, this is a, this is magic for you. So basic. Basic's fine. Yeah. Uh. This yeah. is sly. Remember, it's sly for magic. Then I make yeah. it. I make it. it. Yes. Okay. All right. So, describe to me what you want to do with him. <laughs> I say, burn, mother. <laughs> <laughs> and you watch as a tiny patch of flame goes on the side of his shoulder and goes oh, as he drops you and you poof, onto the ground and scurrying scamper away, away. Get out of there. scampering away as he takes his hand and starts patting it putting it out pretty quickly as he looks around but he's like yeah darn it well I guess it's back to gristle and lizard meat again oh. as he rolls himself back up into uh, into his Rags and curls back up against the chimney. Still okay. on the roof. So you you did the pawn shop. I meant to do the green river, but okay. Yeah, I thought <laughs> I was meant to. Can all we, right. How, how far away is the pawn shop from? I mean, the, you're on top of the pawn shop. How far away is the green river from? Where? It's on the uh, a hop across the alleyway into the next roof. So it's simple. Not Simple's easy. fine. Uh, before you go. Yeah. You saved my life back there, and. I owe you a debt. I don't like to be in debt, but thank you. What's well, good for one of us is good for the entire menagerie. I like that word. <laughs> it's a good word. I owe you one. Do they know it? How are our alley friends doing? Uh, I just, I've hopefully been observing and sniffing the whole time and just sort of. It's a lot of scents in this area. I mean. Yeah, why don't you settle down so you can get a scent of. Uh, yeah, I haven't picked up the witch hunter. He's around. You can smell. Yeah, but you there's Does there's it it's a lot of conflicting scents that are all kind of around you at the moment. It mm. doesn't smell close. In fact, you haven't picked up the scent at this point. It's just there's a lot of conflicting things happening at the moment. Is there a stable attached to the river? The river? No, it's it's enough inland that it wouldn't be it wouldn't necessarily no, it wouldn't. it's not like a tavern or an inn. Okay. Or it's not like an inn which would have a stable. This is right. more a tavern. It's a tavern. Yes. Okay. Mm-hmm. Inn would have kept? stables. Yeah. Can we see if this looks like there might be room? Is it multi floor? Is there, are there it's multi floor. Okay. Uh-huh. It's Can three I, stories. Um, is the door is it one of those like swinging door type taverns? Absolutely. So I mean theoretically I could kind of could I try to Sort of wander yeah, in. If you want to wander in, sure. Yeah. yeah. That might work. You might be just a random bar dog. Right. Or tavern dog. Mm-hmm. Or I could be the dog of one of the patrons. I don't know. As long as they allow such creatures into the. 
All right, uh, then let's make um, let's call that clever because this is interacting with humans and understanding them. Okay. Before he jumps in there, I'm going to open my eyes from my almost meditative state and leap down uh, into the close to the building mm-hmm. and find some rocks or some trash or something to hide by, maybe a gutter. To let Flash go in by himself without a toad on his back. To <laughs> There's suspicion. plenty of trash in this alleyway, by the way. Oh, lovely. Yeah, yeah. and there is a side door leading into the tavern as well. Mm-hmm. It's a little, it's much more rickety and, and the floor is sticky with fluids. Oh. Um, you know, spoiled <laughs> wine mm. is definitely one of the most pungent smells inside of here. Backyard vomit. Back alley vomit, that kind of thing. So, uh, walking in, how'd you do with clever? This is um, didn't roll yet. because this is a because this is kind of a yeah. back alley tavern. Let's call this a seven. I rolled a ten, natural ten, <laughs> natural yeah. ten. Ooh, you dice you strode right in, <laughs> <laughs> sniffing around. You can see that the guys, um, like you, walk in with such confidence, not not like a stray dog would. Right. And uh, or like a dog that doesn't know any better. <laughs> As you kind of come along, you come into the bar, and you can see it's got a it's got an L shaped bar uh, with lots of patrons in it. It's a riverside bar, and there's a dock not too far away. So there's a lot of like dockside workers that come in and off of the river to kind of come get a quick drink in here before they report back to the ship. There's men talking. You don't understand what any of them are saying because you're a dog. Um, uh and you're walking around, and you can see there's men playing cards, and... Do I get a whiff of the witch hunter at all? Uh, uh, no. Okay. There isn't a whiff of the witch hunter, no, unfortunately. Hmm. Um, really uh, wish I could understand human right now. Yeah. As you walk around, you can see there is another dog who seems to just oh. be kind of hanging around by the hearth fire. You can see him chewing on a bone as there's another man who is kind of sitting next to him eating his eating his bowl of stew with his bread as he seems to just be hanging out, um, having his midday meal. I stroll up to the other dog. Ah. It's okay. I don't want your bone. Ah. Okay. How's it going? Mm. I got a bone. That's good. Bones are good. I like bones, but I don't want yours. Don't worry. Good. Don't want your you, don't, you can't have my bone. Okay. Can't have my bone. So, uh. It's my bone. How long have you been here? Mm, I don't know. Master came in about an hour ago. Seen, uh. I don't know. Seen any witch hunters walking around? Witch hunters? <laughs> what the hell would a witch hunter look like? Uh, you know, I don't really know because I've only seen the back of his head, but. Uh, I could convey to you his scent, perhaps. Uh, that's that's a little hard, buddy. You know, <laughs> the nose knows, but it's hard to transfer what the nose knows to the dog's brain. But I know. Yeah, you can sit here by the fire with me. I mean, hell, I see humans walk in and out of here all day. You sure you only saw the back of his head? I don't know. Did I? Yeah, you you saw the back of his head. I mean, he had a distinct. He had a leather jerkin with like a scabbard, like I described to him in the last episode. Yeah, oh, um, that's right. Well, yeah, okay, well, that's right. I remember the scabbard and the... I think he had a cloak, right? Mm-hmm. Hey, Flash, have you been telepathically conveying your conversation? Yeah. Excellent. Why don't you hang out? Yeah, I was thinking about that. Yeah, well, hey, you know, fire's for everybody. So, sit around. Where's your, where's your master at? He's, uh, or she, rather, is uh, back in the woods. Oh, wow. She was actually killed by this guy I'm looking oh. for. So, that sucks. Yeah, I'm trying to like not be too emotional about it right yeah, now. Yeah, you're, you're 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 doing great, man. But like, I'd be I'd be like freaking out, like I, chasing my own tail right now. I know, I know. You know what's crazy though is if I can find this guy, yeah, I can actually bring her back to life. <laughs> smell me. Have you smelled me yet? I'm a magic oh. dog. Oh. You one of those Wizard Academy dogs? No, no. My my master's a witch. Oh. Witches are cool. Uh, yeah, I guess it depends on the witch. But, uh, yeah, master's a wizard. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. I'm surprised you couldn't smell him. I mean, I'm not like, wait, wh- hold on. <laughs> Back up here. You're a magic dog, 
and you have a witch as a master. Yeah. Why the hell am I not a magic dog? You see him looks up to his to his master and he starts like barking at him. <laughs> and you see this this grizzled man who's been eating. He's like, shut up, duty. Yeah, you can't hear him. But Your he, he duty. Knows, but you're her duty. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'm sorry. That's a dumb name, Duty. What, what, what's wrong with Duty, huh? Duty's fine. Duty's my name. Uh, okay. And I like to tell Duty's like, like butter and things. No. Like, he's, he's, yeah, it's not Duty like Duty. It's Duty like Duty. Yeah, but, you know, we dogs can't spell, so. Yeah, that's the honor of What a jit, man. Like, you get to be a magic dog, and you get to. Yeah, I, get, you should take that up with your master. Yeah, I'd also mention the fact that you're. Which is dead and his I master's did. alive. Yeah. Well, I'm just wait, saying, as a yeah. conversational point right now, I'm <laughs> okay. about you being a so magic dog. So you've got <laughs> magic powers because you work with a witch. Yeah. And so you like do stuff for her and things. Yeah, like I, you know, I'll I'll fetch things and um, she taught me a little. She actually taught me a cool little trick. Why Why can't she just do it herself? Uh, well, I mean, you know, that's we're, we're there to serve. We're her familiars. Yeah, so I, I get that. I get that. Know. I get that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Servant. Um, well, shit, man, I wish I could help. Well, li- listen, so I fully described the the guy that I saw. All right, well. If you see this guy, like, or have, have you seen him? Let, let's just, if, there's, there's, there's nefarious characters coming in and out of this place all the time. I'm trying to find this guy. I've got his scent. I don't smell him right now. But if you see him, bark. Yeah, man, I'll tell you what. Uh, Master lets me out for a couple hours every single night so I can go, you know, mark my territory and stuff. That's pretty um, awesome. He, so I'll have a little bit of time tonight and I'll, I'll do a little pass around for you. Just come by the, uh, come by the, uh, the, the southmost wizard tower. There's a stable back there. Master uh, keeps up with the horses. Interesting. Yeah. Okay. So come by tonight. I'll definitely come by. And if I see anything, then I'll, I'll let you know. Listen, just so you know, also, Duty, um, I've got some <laughs> friends with me. Okay. Uh, like what kind of friends? Like other dogs? Not exactly. I've got a, <laughs> I've got a fox friend, a toad friend, and a rabbit friend. But they're all magical, too. And they're cool. They're cool. Whoa, dude. Uh... Would you rather me like have them not come? Should I come alone, or can I bring my friends? Because uh, they're gonna want to. We're all trying really hard to get revenge. I'm just saying, day. man, you're cool. Like I get you, because you know we're dogs. Yeah. And we're like sharing talk between a bone here. Mm-hmm. Man, like I have to tell you, I've got oh, I've got histories with with hairs. Okay. Really. Yeah, I just gotta I just gotta let you know that. Um, all right, well, I'll have them stay out of sight. Okay. Then. Because I I I. I'm just promising that, you know, I may not I may not be myself if I see that thing. Okay. Totally understood. All right. Well, he is with foxes. <laughs> <laughs> but uh just, yeah, yeah, yeah. Just just come by the stables, ask around for duty. Uh that's me. You know <laughs> that. Um yeah, dude. Good luck. Awesome. I'll see you tonight. All right, see you tonight. See yeah, you tonight. Maybe we'll pee on the same tree together or something. <laughs> yeah. uh, that's <laughs> fucked up, man. Don't do that. <laughs> Don't cross the stream. You know, that's, that's cro- bad. I wasn't, I wasn't suggesting crossing the stream. Okay, so no, it's fine. Cool. But, you know, if it's if, if, if I mark the spot, that's mine, man. You I, know, I get it. You can't I do that. It. I know. You know? I'm just, you know, pulling. I'm pulling your leg, <laughs> literally, and then I, and then I bite his, I, I bite his leg. <laughs> All right, get out of here, okay, guys. Or don't. Got, I don't care. We're I've just, got a great lead. I think. I think yeah, I got so. a great lead. From duty. From duty. <laughs> yeah, that's funny. Well, what do you think, Toad? Sounds good. I've been uh, cleaning up and organizing all of this trash in this corner, and it's perfectly organized <laughs> and segmented it's, it's like, into little squares. I've never I've realized. folded all of this trash and newspapers. And OCD. <laughs> wow. Mm-hmm. <laughs> this is the cleanest corner of little alleyway. It's just made little tiny squares of tiny trash. <laughs> That's great work. It's little 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 piles of tidy trash. That's really aesthetically pleasing, man. Right. Just, I'm digging the trash. Just see, just see his little toad hands just, just <laughs> moving them together. Me, me, me. Me, me, me. <laughs> uh, Alright. Uh, Should we go down and join them? We don't seem to have done us any good up here. Well, I, I mean, I, I think 
He's he wants us to meet him by the stables, yeah. by the Wizard Academy. Yeah, sounds good. Sounds no, good. Sounds promising. I don't know. This feels pretty good. In fact, we can maybe even go check out those stables as soon as it gets dark and see if I can pick up the scent of the witch hunter's horse. Cool. We can come too, right? Yeah. yeah. But here's the only thing. So he's got a history with hairs. Mm. I don't know what he meant by that, but I think when I go meet him initially to get the information, you guys should maybe hang back a little bit. Not gonna lie, like, can... that hurts my feelings a little bit. I know, but I mean, we we've got a bigger. Yeah, you know. Yeah, no, it's fine. Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. Are you sure? It's fine. No, 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 no. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll okay. deal with foxes. I didn't even get that far when he mentioned that he had a problem with hairs. Dude, I just dude, figured... dude! It's a realization. For a fox and a half. Yeah! <laughs> and a toad, and a hair. Yeah. Oh. That's not as... That's not as... Topical. Oh. <laughs> you never saw that movie? I don't understand. The fox and the hound and the hare and the toad? So, oh. Expanded? Well, that one never oh. got released. That was, was, that the, was that the unreleased right. sequel? Yeah. <laughs> it just didn't get off it, the, Yeah. I remember. Sort of died right. in script revisions. Yes, the children's film, The Fox and the Hound. Yes, yeah. very good. <laughs> I remember. Yeah, good thing. Children's film... I I remember that. Huh. So what are we? We got some time to kill here. What are we gonna do? Uh, Where are we? You're uh, still in the alleyway in You're the back the of uh, the Green Wyvern. Oh, we talking telepathically? Yeah, yeah. I mean, uh, I think I think um, Flash could have come out and met you back in the alleyway. But... Should we jump down? Yeah. We've done all, all the damage down. we can do. Yeah. Here. <laughs> yeah. Is there a Boy. fire on the roof right now? <laughs> no, region. he padded himself out and went back to sleep. <laughs> I think we yeah. should just hide until. All right. Yeah. Until it's night. time to go. Well, is could, there other stables we can we check out? Or yeah. Can we go to the stables now? These same stables, or well, it's still pretty be pretty be dangerous to get risky. there. It's, I, I think it's probably better to wait for the cover. Just wait for the cover tonight. Let's just all settle down and get some rest, huh? Okay, so you're all kind of settling in, and um, make sure this isn't a well-traveled alleyway that's going to get us in any kind of trouble. No, there, I mean, it depends. Are you all going to hide out of sight in the alleyway? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. So sorry um, to disrupt your trash. Not at all. I'm going to need a little bit of it. For <laughs> uh, then let's all. Then let's just uh, everyone. Let's make or make one person the biggest person, which is probably oh, the dog. The dog. Um, how do you make a simple, clever check? Hmm. Uh. Flash. Seriously. I need, if I were to make that, I would need four bennies. Ooh. Wow. Why don't you take a danger point instead? Also, right. you got out um, hair and fox. Uh -huh. You got out of that dangerous situation. I'll allow you to take a danger off. Yeah. 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 For that, yeah. that danger thing. down. That, <laughs> for that thing you got rid of or got away from earlier. We do like danger down. Fine. It seems like it's Twitch Prime subs that we're not here for some reason. You just got three in a row. Oh, Woo! Hey! Thank Good you, everybody. Turn. Thank you for your hey. Twitch Prime hey. subs. Hey. Excellent. Um, great. All right. Well, uh, so in the midst of, so take a danger point. And what will happen is, is, is as you're kind of walking around, you're, you're, everyone else is well hidden, but you're not. So when one of the serving ladies came out to like basically take out some trash, like throw some slop out from the back alleyway mm -hmm. and just chucked it out. Um, you just got soaked in it. Uh, yeah, just Ugh. soaked in like filthy bath water. Oh. 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 Now you smell like filthy bath water dog. Oh. All right. Oh. Can I run back to the room and clean myself up? Uh, it's, it's, <laughs> yeah, I mean, you can, yeah, if you want to go walk over to the river. <laughs> So yeah. I guess you're still still doing it fine. So um, I'll use my tidy spell, <laughs> my magic. Sure, mm -hmm. simple. Cleaning, simple, simple, simple. simple. Uh, sly, simple. Magic as always. Oh, got good, it. Good, Nailed good, it. Good. Thank Question. you. All right. Yeah. Um, I feel like I just went to the groomers. Yeah. Yeah. He fixed the problem. Take the danger point away. I guess. <laughs> oh, all right. Even yeah. better. I'm just gonna make you smell like shit while you're walking through the streets, <laughs> but. Not, Not anymore. Regular dog. No, they I'm smell tired. like regular dog. <laughs> um, great. Uh, nighttime comes around. Uh, as you watch as evening comes by, you watch as the streets become thinner. Uh, the Briefly, as the sun starts to go down, as you can see the kind of the nighttime 
nighttime crowd starts to kind of emerge in which the more... Mm, well, you don't understand humans that well. You watch as the thin, thinning crowd kind of thins briefly and as the sun sets, you watch as more people start coming into the street. You watch as more men start to kind of like lounge and hang out at the mouth of the alleyway. You see people there, but people are kind of taking various positions. Um, no guard has looked for you at all at this point. You can also hear like just a general what was kind of loud and boisterous before. Now people start to be talking in harsh whispers and subtle body movements at this time of night. And you can see as the peddlers in the carts that were selling the street meat of the day have now completely left and have have any of them dropped any bad street meat? Uh, no, they're pretty good about picking it up. But you that does remind you, you are all famished. Mm, Anything right? to hunt in this alleyway? Anything to hunt? Well, that would be uh That's street meat. That nice would be clover. that would be some fierce going on there. The, if you want to go hunting, that is that is that is fierce. Right. Okay. Yeah. Alleyway and, and, and further away from people, not closer to. Okay. Ten. Ten. Uh, dirty ten or natural ten? Good job. Uh, dirty ten. Dirty ten. Great. So, Brother Fox, you, as you start walking around and you can see as you're kind of uh, going through along the bank of the river and in different parts and you can actually um, find yourself catching a sizable lizard. Nice. You know, that you crunch and eat without any problems. Nice. Feeling feeling a little better about yourself. Okay. You can also hear the whispers of several what appears to be small rodents that seem to be talking underneath the bridge. Right, yeah, do you see them? Yeah, there's 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 some new animals in town. Yeah. You know, I've seen a I've seen it's like it's like a fox and a hare and a toad and they're one of the I hear they're witches familiars. Right? Yeah. Well, what do you think we should do? Well, nothing. They're, just, they're magic. Yeah, but you know, you know what happens when wizards and witches come into town? You hear another one, well, yeah, what happens? Well, <laughs> they, they do magic, you idiot. And that's the problem. Magic causes humans to hunt us, and then we lose our space in this town. Do you want that to happen around? No, I don't. I like my home. Well, then we should be doing something about it. As you... Do you want to get closer? <laughs> I'm trying to stay right here and listen. Okay. You can hear as they start to scurry and walk away a little bit. As you hear. As you hear. Uh, it's hard. You're in the kind of the tall grass parts right. of the area, but it definitely sounds like multiple voices all kind of whispering together. Right, I'm going to kind of get a little closer and see what they are. All right. Make a sly check. Simple. Six. <laughs> Take a danger point. <clears throat> or I just, just, uh, I'm just going to run. Hey, I'm just going to run. What? what? I'm just going to run. No. It's one of those foxes. I'm Get, run skitter, away from the problem. Skitter, run. I want to wait for the problem. So <laughs> you run, they run, everybody scatters and runs. Right. So do I still get a danger point? It says you run away from the problem, you'll get one. Yeah, yeah, you can take the danger point off. Okay. All right. not, it's not, you're not in danger situation. I'm, I'm going to run back and tell the guys what I heard. Right. So, we have a situation. What is it, brother? Really? What's wrong? Well, the rest of the animals have uh, noticed that we've come into town and they know that we're dealing with which. We're witch, uh, witch kin, or whatever you want to call it. Witch and kin. they're concerned that they're going to start getting hunted because we're going to cause some noise and do some things that will draw attention to the animals. Oh, well, that doesn't sound like something we do. In any event, they're going to get hunted. <laughs> to keep an eye out for the rustlings. I wasn't able to tell what kind of animals there were. It sounded like there was one larger animal, but it was definitely more than one. And I'm sure they're spreading the word now as they stirred off when they heard me. Well, if I don't get something to eat soon, they are going to get hunted by me. I also do not care. And if any other animals cross our paths, I say we kill them. The most important thing to do. Toad, you're brutal. Just Hard. brutal. <laughs> he is a reptile. Amphibian. I think they're amphibians. Correct. But the most important thing to do is get those eyes so that we can bring our witch back to life. That's true. We are kind of on a mission of murder, fine. mission of murder, so the whole brutal thing right. does kind Maybe. of fit in. We need, we need him. We need him to keep us grounded. Yeah. Mm. Totally. 
<laughs> you know what? Did you give him a Benny for that? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was a Benny for that. All right, uh, so you... Isn't there... Shouldn't there be some... Uh, some is there anything that yeah, you guys can do some good there? grass... Oh, right. Um, there's there's the plenty leaves. of grass in which to graze. But if you don't want to be uh, noticed by humans, you're going to have to make it clever. Wow. Oh, All right. Yeah. I don't want to be noticed by humans, and I want to hunt small insects and bugs. You're also close to the, the riverbank, so you can also go down to the riverbank with them to do the same. Let me, uh, let me ask you this. Since I already walked in to the Green Wyvern and, you know, un- well, seemed totally clever. unassuming... Could I theoretically walk back in there? Yeah, beg for scraps for clever. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Cool. Mm. I got an eight. Okay. Yeah, that is some good begging. <laughs> That's some good begging. You pulled the puss in boots. <laughs> Three. Uh, oh, what would I? What did I need? Clever. About? Clever. Mm. Oh no, for you it's not. You're not interacting with humans, so yeah. uh, it's whatever. Quick. Okay. Uh, can I, I do it yeah, simple? simple. Yeah. Can so I do it? I got simple. I got Good. six. Simple. Can I do it quick instead? Uh, no, you fail. Take a danger point. Uh, and while you're out grazing for grass, you can you actually have a hard time doing any grazing because as you're sitting and starting to eat, somebody sees you, sees a rabbit. And on this side of Docktown, everyone's interested in getting some lean meat for dinner. And they just keep chasing you, and you just keep going from like place to place to place until you eventually get yeah, fed of it. I just, I just want to have some of my grass in peace. Yeah. But you just keep getting chased from point to point to point before you eventually get back into your your hidden alleyway spot. Are there any veg- veggies in the alley? Rotten veggies or anything? Or uh, there is definitely rotten veggies, but it's not very satiating. In fact, it's pretty gross. Yeah. So um, until you until you get a little nutrient in your system, I'm going to say you can't do your magic. Oh. Okay. All right. Um, but re- three of you, good, good, good. Yeah. Nom, 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 nom. yeah. Scraps, some good insects. Little cricket, ooh, a cricket. <laughs> tasty, tasty lizard. <laughs> and a tasty, tasty lizard. So, uh, great. Um, every, yeah, until nightfall, yeah. I mean, is there anything? Uh, yeah. And it's getting, it is getting pretty close to the evening to where you could theoretically meet up with, um, ooh, it's nighttime now. We can, we can dispense with this. Um, Do you have nighttime sounds? It is starting to get darker. Nighttime's coming into it. You could be about the time where you can meet up with duty, or you can continue to explore around the town as you wish to see if you can find more leads. Um, you know, there is obviously... Yeah, it's night. We can get around a little easier. You have a little more freedom of movement this time at night. Freedom. It's not the middle of the day right. when people are going to be chasing rabbits around. All right. All right. Let's, uh, right. Shall we... Shall we... Yeah. Should we roam around a little bit? See if we can sure. write something? Let's Either start way, roaming right. towards the... Um, to- I mean, we'll just we're investigate as much as we can on our way to the South Tower. Yeah. yeah. All right, so we're going to... That seems our best bet. Keep everything eyes and ears open on our way to I'll the South Tower. I'll sniff and see if I smell any other um, stables or anything right. that might, you know... I'll look around for any... Any whiff at all of that hunter. Yeah, I'll Got look around it. for anything that might uh, suggest super unsavory types hanging okay. off there or... That type of business. Yeah. Stand by. Standing by. Uh, <laughs> okay. Um, you write an awful lot on that piece of paper. What's going on? Uh, great. So as you're walking into various parts of the town, you're able to duck and dodge with a little more ease. Um, Still quick checks to get to the next place, but it's a simple quick check. Okay. Not difficult Oh, anymore. I'm going to blow a natural pen on that quick check. Yeah, <laughs> and, yeah now I roll high. Yeah. I'm, I'm writing on flashback, so Great. I need to roll. No. Okay. I need two bennies. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. Good God. Can I just take some of my pen off? And since it's a natural pen, can I extend it? Don't you wish. Yeah, I do. That's my ass. Yeah. <laughs> Where's the try, right? It's not 7C anymore. So as you're, as you're ducking and weaving and bobbing in between each one of the alleyways, you can see that um, you know uh, most of the shops are closed. Uh, you can see there is people walking to and from, but definitely as you're, as you're walking out of Riverside, because the... Yes. I'm going to keep an eye out for any veggies that might help. 
great. Oh. Um, uh, it's also, since I darted around successfully, can I take off a danger point? Or? No. That's danger points that you've accumulated for a while. I'd say no. Okay. No, you didn't accumulate one in that um, in that failed check. So I would have taken that away otherwise. So. Oh, I didn't earn one for that one. You didn't okay. earn okay. one. Got it, got it, got it. <clears throat> so as you're moving, you coming through, you see that there is... Uh, you're getting into the like the nicer part of town mm -hmm. as you're coming into where the wizard tower is and because it's the nicer part of town and you seem to be going down a commercial avenue uh, there isn't a lot of activity so you're able to kind of duck weave and bob without too much difficulty but you do have this weird feeling of being watched oh. as you move from place oh to place. god it's probably the other animals so uh, this you can't see anything and the smells of the town seem to be. Um, is it quiet? It's constant. Is you know, there isn't anything new that's coming in as far as the smells go. What was that? Is it more quiet than it should be animal wise? I mean, it's a quiet town. But animal wise, you know? Uh, it is, I mean, and that's part of what makes it feel eerie is you don't really hear sounds, but you occasionally, like, it's that thing where you kind of see mov movement out of the side of your eye, but then you look and there's nothing there. Or stay together, guys. It's the mm -hmm. same with the sets, and it's the same with the smells. Mm -hmm. So you're creeping through, you're getting a little closer. And um, as you start to walk and take a side alley, uh, you take a side alley to kind of cut into a larger part of where the stables are, as you are walking through to the edge of an alley, you see as <clears throat> a single rat comes into the midst of the alley. I'm gonna, I'm gonna immediately look behind us. You look around and you see another rat <sighs> coming right behind you. And they both stand up on their hind legs and Check look at you. Check above. You look above and you can start to see as more rats <sighs> like come on along the side of each one of the brick uh, brick slates as you watch as like a a a, uh, a line of rats all kind of are peering down and then front behind you that single rat starts to see as a small mob comes around on each back and you see as one of them starts bounding up towards you <clears throat> so welcome back I brought my family now, you, he points to the hair, goes, you're going to pay for making me all squished. <laughs> oh, little rat. What's you so funny? You know what we are, don't you? <sighs> We're witches familiars. Yeah, so I'm told. But I also know that there's only four of you. Get them, boys! So, let em. And you watch as they all kind of like start scampering all the, both of the groups of rats from the front and the back start. Is there anything rats. around? Um, yeah, is there like anything latched or like anything that I could maybe make fall or anything with my open magic? Uh, there is, uh, there's a couple Beams of or... windows that are up on the top. Um, there is uh, more side doors like okay. stairs leading into side doors, okay. um, leading into the buildings that are next to you. Right. Uh, there does seem to be a few rain barrels, oh. and that's about as much as what you can see kind of around you. There's obviously uh, various cobblestones and parts, but you can also see rats are kind of coming out from various holes, like uh, rain gutters and things, as they're coming down from from the gutters into the side as you watch as... 75 you know, rats. 75 or more even rats right. are just like a like a like a plague just jumping across into you. What do you want what do you like to do? Run. Should we, should we make it for the uh run. Let's yeah. run. Run. All right, spiral through. You run. You, yeah. you want to Yeah, let's go. Uh, you want to let them know what, what you, you could light one of them on fire on the way out. <laughs> yeah, I don't have I don't have my oh, yeah, my powers right now. Yeah. One of them will find anything to eat. Okay. Oh, uh yeah. Yeah, let's let's plant. go quickly. I could grow a plant around one really quick. Not quite as as, is there as anything, intimidating. Is there anything as my can we that would fall on the rats? Anything that that could fall on the rats? Yes. Uh, there is 
Uh, there is a couple of potted plants that seem to just be kind of crested on oh, either side. Oh, so if they open the window? Wait, so if you open the window, you can knock over a plant or so. Yeah. Yes. All right, I'm going to knock over a plant that you make it grow. Okay. All right, so okay. that is going to be uh, it's going to be challenging. It's yeah. an eight. So open that up. Me too. Or what's uh, what's what skill? Am I what using? are you doing? You once he drops the plant on him, then I'm going to make it grow on him. Right All right, now. that's also challenging. Go, 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 go. What's, what's our skill here? Eight or six or seven. What's man. what's uh, the uh, skill? What skill is it? Uh, every magic is sly. Sly. Okay. Uh oh. Ten, not natural. Dirty ten, bitch. Okay. Dirty ten. I, I, dirty I, need, I need four bennies. Four bennies? Yeah, take sorry, take I'm four. the four. Yeah, but we gotta make this happen. We bennies gotta like make this, this happen. <laughs> okay. Dirty ten, bitches. Dirty ten. Do we get any more Twitch subscribers from uh, yeah. Amazon? You're down to three now. Um, got anything? This is, this is necessary. Two more. Two more. Oh, two yeah. more. <laughs> We're up to five now. Up to five. So, uh, you look up at the top and you can feel as the... Um, as the magic courses through you and you look up and you hear the door, the window, uh, slide open <laughs> as if someone was like opening up and being like, what day is it? Kind of situation. <laughs> there as, goes the baker with his bread. <laughs> as uh, the pot spirals down and cracks along the side of the uh, cobblestone floor and you hear as a couple of rats, um, maybe one or two get squished from underneath, but then the rest uh, just part around it like a tide coming, cutting through a rock uh, as they can just scatter through. That moment, then you watch as as the plant starts to grow as the vineage basically comes along the cross and you can feel as it makes a little bit of a, of a, uh, of a, of a rose bush bramble wall as it comes through and you can see it kind of cuts off one half of the rats, nice. while the other half is still on the other side, but you basically put up a rose bush wall that's making their advance to you from the front come a lot slower. So right. are we moving deeper into the alleyways or back towards the street? I don't know, what are you doing? I yell out. I'm saying, where, where's the, which, one, which side is the bramble wall on? Take over the rain The barrel. one in front of you. Ooh, so, it so it's in the alleyway. So that's good, the streets is where you wanna go anyway. So you're the, there's a street on either end of the alleyway. Right. In front of you is a bramble wall that's cut off half of the rats. rats. And then behind you, where you came from, is the other the half other of the rat. The other tie. Am I the near barrel. a rain barrel? Uh, there is rain barrels close to you, sure. You'll have to go, and you have to kind of like, you basically have to like advance yourself into the rats a little bit in order to get to mm. it. But yes. So I'll, that I'll would really. I'll yeah. mess you up and, and fight the rats while you're right. in the rain barrel. I run towards a rain barrel to try to kick it over onto the rats. You want to kick over a rain barrel then? So it yeah. like rolls down the alley. That's, a, that's probably... Well, also the water inside would probably... Do something, like, yeah. Well then how about you do a fierce then? Yes. Right. yes. And I'm going to protect him and, and, and fight this, off any rats. This is there. challenging, so it's an eight. I got, I got a six. Total? Yeah. Take the, take take the bunnies. Let's take, take those two we just got. This All right. Twitch right. Prime. Which those two Twitch Primes. All right. Why don't you uh, Why don't you describe to me right. how you kick over this rain barrel? So I, I, you know, yeah, bound over to the rain barrel, and then uh, with my hind legs, I plant here, and then I kick at the rain barrel so that it rolls over the rats, and the water goes everywhere. Yeah, it just washes. So basically, this tide of rats mm -hmm. is coming to, her, and as soon as as soon as uh, the as soon as dog or Flash or um, Ho Hal uh, pushes over the rain barrel, <laughs> it is like two tides meeting. Whoosh, as they kind of like the rats are pushed as they sweep as they squeak and basically washes them uh, several feet back against the other side of the alleyway. You watch as they kind of go. Go, 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 go. Everybody run, 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 make quicks to see if you can you can ride the wave of the yes. rain barrel. Bam! Thirteen. 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 Ten. Ten? Five. Thirty-eight. Uh, it's it's a basic, so you're gonna need two. What did you wait, wait, what's your My quick's one and I rolled a four. Ugh. Use two bennies. So. <laughs> two you could or take a danger point. Use two bennies. Yeah. We'll take a danger point. How, How many, many danger we got points left? you got? Three. Like we have a million. How many points. danger points you got? Uh, I've got two danger points already. Bennies. Okay. You got one left. All right, I'm taking them. All right, so you all basically run along the side of the water as the rats are pushed against the current 
as uh, it slides up and they dump into the main street as you leap over the stunned rats as they <laughs> kind of get up and attempt to shake off their fur as they uh, as you basically bound around and head just. Since I was super fast, can I pin the one? Can I round on that one? The one that was coming at you yeah. was uh, behind you, uh, and it was kind of the... advancing. So he's still chasing you at the moment. You hit the you hit the back force, right? Is what you did. Okay. I mean, there's still plenty of rats to pick from. <laughs> All right, can I pick one of them? If you want to grab one, yeah. Sure. How do you want to grab it? Uh, I just basically hop on top of them. You just want to hop on top of yeah. one? Okay. <laughs> This is even, this isn't even our full strength. You have no idea what we're all capable of. You tell the others that we don't want to make any trouble. We're just here. Remember, we, we offered to help feed those 75 mouths, but now, now this is war, so you better stay away from us or we will rain terror upon you. We couldn't go that way. You see as the rat looks up to you and it just bears its teeth. <laughs> Pierre told us that you squished him and threatened his life. No one threats the family. You get out or we're going to find you. And if you kill one of us, that's fine. There'll still be more. We're everywhere. We're everywhere. We've made an enemy of that rut yield. <laughs> but seriously, don't hurt me. Please don't hurt me. Don't do it. I want to jump on its neck and snap it. Okay. Fuck. Uh, it's Clean dead. kill. Yeah. Clean <laughs> kill. I couldn't understand it, but we're on a schedule. Let's go. Toad. Seriously. <laughs> <laughs> so as you guys scamper all the way through, um, you uh, uh, you basically just 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 run beeline straight for the towers, um, getting close to where the uh, the the stables are. Do and not be in view. <laughs> Fern? Right. Yeah. And Don't you can here. see yeah. as, as you're basically hopping from street lamp to street lamp, and this area of town is much more lit. So it's mm. getting a little harder for you to kind of like find shadows. And you do see that the area around the stables is extremely well lit with what seems to be these um, lanterns that don't have fire. They seem to just. Wizard emit. lanterns? Wizard lanterns, yes. They just seem to kind of emit lanterns. light. Uh, everywhere around there, and you can you can see as a bunch of horses are just you know pawing and to gently nibbling on hay. Do any of those horses smell familiar to me? Um, do you want to go and sniff each one's butt? Yes, I do. Okay. I will sniff every horse's butt. All right, so go and sniff every so horse's we're, butt. So we're we're in the stables, though, right? <laughs> uh, he is. Oh. Okay. What are you all in the stables? Uh, uh, I thought but the, the, he's the not general there, right? plan. No, we were Duty gonna was, we were gonna stay. Uh, hang back. That you guys were gonna yeah. hang back while I talk to. And keep an eye out for rats. <laughs> right. If it's a sta if we're near the stables, so there's lots of hay there, and I can nibble on some of that, right? That's get true. Get some of that hay. You can go and nibble on some of that hay if you want to get into that stable area. Yep. Uh, all right. I'm gonna nibble on some of that hay real quick. All right. And then retreat back. I'm gonna nibble on some of that hay. I Feeling jump, better. I jump off of Flash's back. Yeah. Hop onto Brothers. Brothers. So you're feeling better now. You can use your magic again now. Good. Hair. Um, as you go around, you start sniffing butts, and you can see a couple of the horses. <laughs> Made, you know. <clears throat> oh, it's a dog. Great. Hey, guys. Hello. I'm just looking Hello. for a specific horse. Hello! <laughs> Mr. Red? <laughs> No, they call me Bill. <laughs> Hi, Bill. What's your name? My name's Flash. That's a weird name for a dog. It's because I'm really, really fast. You one of Duty's friends? I can I, smell them on you. I am one of Duty's friends. I'm actually he meeting him here in a little bit. He should be back in a bit. Great. You want some hay? Sure. Kicks the back of his leg a little bit, <laughs> some straw like flies out <laughs> through the back of the stable and Seriously, settles in. Sure, you're not in view. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's great. Slop or anything? Yeah. Nope. Pigs are on the other side. This is where the horses are. I'm a horse. Are they right? You are. That's right. <laughs> Amazing. It's exciting, isn't it? It really is. 
What can horses I, are cool. What's, what's your duty with duty? Oh, um, he was just going to show me around, actually. I'm new oh. to the city. That's nice of him. I could show you around, too, if I wasn't tied to this thing. I bet you Would you let me out? Yeah, why not? All right, I'd I, love running around, and I hate being in these stables at night. I think all I think all animals should be free. That's a very, very... <laughs> but! Yes. I'm not going to let you out right now, because here's what's going to happen. Why not? Because if I let you out, it would cause a disturbance, and all the wizards would come out, and the information that I'm trying to get from duty, I wouldn't get. Well, well I don't care about the wizards, but if it's going to prevent you from talking to duty... I can wait a little bit. I promise I'll let you out later, though. Promise? Uh, yeah, I promise I will. I can tell if you're lying. Okay, well, I'm not lying. Okay. okay. Good conversation. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> Thanks, Bill. <laughs> you can see his, 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 as duty, uh, duty kind of, um, you can smell him a little bit as he kind of like comes out. As you watch as the, the stable door opens, as uh, his master basically lets him and goes, <clears throat> lets him out, swings the door back shut again. Duty like walks down and goes, oh, <clears throat> oh hey, hey Duty, <laughs> what's up, Flash? Um, just you know, trying to find that crazy killer guy. I know, man. Well, the master just let me out, dude. So I haven't really gotten a chance to do my walk arounds yet. Okay, mind if I go with you? Sure, let's do it. So. Uh, Flash. Yeah. Do you mention that we pissed off the rats? Oh, right. <laughs> so we kind of... Be kind of vague about the details. Yeah. Just be yeah. like, hey, we just got picked on by yeah. a bunch of what's really the deal with bully the, rats. What's the deal with the rats in this town? Oh, man, they're a, uh, they're a saucy bunch, but they're pretty harmless if you just leave them alone. Well, <laughs> unfortunately... And they really don't like it when you, when you, you know... Go after them. I mean, the occasional strays. What you want to do if you're hungry, if you want to eat some rat, I can show you some good outcasts. What I'm really looking for is some vegetables for one of my companions. Uh, you can see how I can get that way. <laughs> Crazy dog eyes. <laughs> I already ate. No, no, no. I'm uh, already ate. Oh, okay. Ate. Never mind. I'm not. Okay, I'm not. Okay. I'm fine. Thanks. Yeah, okay. Thanks, okay. buddy. Right. You're, you're making. You're making me think of like. No, no, no. Like Don't think of anything. Let's just go walk. Second. Let's okay. go for All right. a walk. Walk's, walking's good. Walking's good. Walking's good. Um, <laughs> you guys... Should we like uh, follow along or? Well, no, I could. Don't you guys stay put? Just I've just got. We, we've side. got this telepathy. You also, you also have, you also have a wizard tower that's in front of you. That um, you want to go check out the wizard we tower? We could totally check out that wizard tower. Uh, I would like the fox. Actually, I'd like all of you to make a um, a clever check real quick. My only concern is, as long as it's not what is it? Uh, simple six. Good. I need Good. one Benny, please. Okay. You just barely Benny. made it. Last one. We're out. <gasps> I'll do it. We need more Bennies, please. Thank you. If you haven't subscribed, we that was a them. wonderful time. Right. We could use them. We need some subscribers. Hey. Hey. Yeah, hey. thank you. Thank you. Thank back, you. Benny back in the bowl. <laughs> now you're not empty again. Uh, so as the three of you <clears throat> are walking around, um, I'll get back to, to duty and flash in a second. Um, as the three of you are walking, uh, you kind of see as the main, as the back door to the South Wizard Tower opens, not the stable door in which Duty's master let him out, but the back door leading into the actual tavern itself. Um, you, you're kind of standing next to there, and as 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 a as a man comes out, he seems to be like a scribe because he seems to have these light robes on him with a, carrying a bunch of paper and ink bottles, and he looks exhausted as he seems to just be like walking home in the midst of the night. As the door opens and closes, you catch a whiff <coughs> of a familiar scent. Your master. Oh, shoot. Really? Yes, you can get the faintest smell of the witch. That's her, you guys, that's her. Well, it's her scent, she's dead, so I doubt it's her. Her head. It's probably a place she's it might be her it head, It could be guys. her head. Wait, he went through a door? He, basically when the door opened, uh, you it. got a wolf, but then the door shut again, right behind him. All right, let's investigate this door. All right, so investigate. We're, I'll tell you about it in just a second. You have to roll for it. It's not a dangerous situation. Um, I'm going to go back to Yeah, uh, walking duty. around with duty. Walking Doing our duty. duty. <clears throat> so, uh, <coughs> Flash, 
Yeah. What do you uh what do you like to do when you're not doing witch's stuff? Uh I feel like I like to run. I like to chase yeah. cats. Uh, me too, man. I, I love like chasing to, cats. You know, I like to stretch out in the sun. Hey, man, I know, like, if you get your witch back and stuff, yeah. uh, you know, that's what you're looking to do. But even if you even if you do, like, we should hang out, dude. Oh, totally. In fact, if I get my witch back, like, I'm, you know, I'm not making any promises. Oh, but, don't you, don't you, ma- dude, don't you I'm say what I think you're say. I'm putting in a word. I'm, all I'm saying is I'm going to put in a word for you. Oh, you know? That's crazy. What's, what type of things do you think I could do? Well, I mean, uh, with, with. Her familiars, we all have like little cool little powers. All right, like what you know, do you do? Like, like I can, can grow, pl- I can grow plants. Ah, uh, it's awesome. Uh, t- t- tell I'm, him he can make dinner whenever he wants. He might be able to do that. That's, yeah. that's doable. I mean, you might be able to like conjure food. What? I'm just saying. What? I'm just saying. Look, all right, I'm getting you way too excited. Okay, okay. We're, okay. We're, let's we're let's, find our, let's find this yeah, guy. Let's find this guy. We got to find this let's guy. Let's do this. Let's do this. I told you we have to take his eyes, right? Well, that's weird. That's really <laughs> weird, man. Um, okay. Yeah, like I got really excited <laughs> yeah. about the whole making food things, but then you threw the eye thing at me, and I don't know what to think. Also, I'm pretty sure that he has our witch's head. So we need what? to get the head back and then take his eyes out. I say we just uh, kill him, because I mean, you know, all is fair. Right? Man, every single time I think like we're making a good stride here, you gotta drop some weird bomb on me, dude. I know. Ask him what he you Like your red you flags is equal to like your green if, flags. What would at the you moment. do if your master got killed? Oh, I'd, uh, I guess that's a, that's a good question. Like, so, and, and if you knew that you had to kill someone and take their eyes out to make your master come back, you'd probably <sighs> wanna do that, wouldn't you? Yeah, I'd do it. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I do. Especially like, I mean, man, and making food whenever you want. I mean, I'm just saying it yeah, is. That's worth. A, that's worth a dude's it's eyes. It's out there. Okay. <laughs> you could also set things on fire. Imagine conjuring your own food and then cooking it, setting it on fire and cooking it. That'd be pretty cool. You could make jerky. Man, I I don't know how, what I'm doing, but I feel like I'm making a deal with the devil here just by talking. To you at the moment, but well, you know, man. Anyway, so <laughs> witch, devil, but, you know, they're all kind of in that same general area. <laughs> and yeah, and I'm, I'm just, I'm saying, I'll put in a word. Let's just, let's, let's, uh, hey, Flash, why don't we just stick with just like finding your guy, okay? Yeah, okay. All right. We'll start we there. Talk about decapitated heads and eyes later. Uh, so you guys walk around. We're gonna leave you be to kind of sniff it out. Great. Ex- exam things. You three, you've magnificently split the party. Um, there is a, uh, uh, the tower has several, several openings. They're all like um, the kind of uh, turreted windows that you would expect on a stone tower. Right. But they're definitely, the first one is only as high as the second floor. So, and the, tur- and the tower itself um, is, is fairly large. So it has... And it seems to be connecting the other three towers at several other bridges leading up into it. Right. So this is the only entrance on the ground floor, but uh, you can you can basically see bridges connecting to each one of the towers. And this door in particular, that's the only one leading to the outside. You can see there is a there is a, a stone gate that's kind of making a triangle complex amidst the three towers. Okay. So this is the outermost part of the stable on the grounds. Your options for getting in is either to get to that window, try to get in through the door, Mm -hmm. um, or you could attempt to climb over the wall into the grounds. Don't get toads climb walls. Is there vine growth? No, I mean, toads can actually... Like in the sticky cups. I don't think he's a gecko. I think he's a a toad. I'm a toad. Yes. There is definitely vine growth. Good looking that vine I can growth. Work with. All yes. right, let's. Uh, can you can you work with? I'm gonna try. I can I can work with that. Yeah, so we're right. gonna we're have to get to the second floor window. window. Yeah. Correct. Oh, if you're, you've grown that. There, I said there are, there's vines in the walls, but there's enough ivy growth, not enough to support a man, but definitely enough to support a toad. About a we are not men. What about a small? What about now a box? for the four figured, four footed ones? It's a little harder. You don't have grasping hands. The way that like a toad does, um, but I mean we can climb stuff. Up. Turtles climb fences, bro. I think we, you know, they do. 
I will pull up a picture of Turtles oh, Climbing Fences. You don't believe me. It's true. Turtles Climbing Fences. Uh, and you are familiar. You're not just regular animals. Exactly. Yeah. So, this is not. Um, well, so for the toad, up a little bit. for the toad, it's a simple check, but for you two, it's a challenging check. Well, I did it with simple. Great. I did that task, no problem. So I climbed up the vine up to the second yeah. floor window. We made it. Skin my teeth, but and made now it. Now we have <laughs> Brother did Fox not. up there. Brother Fox not. has the it. ability to. So you'd have to stay it. down if you wanted to. Right. Or you know what? No, we'll uh, we'll I take a danger point. Let's do this. Okay. I know what I'm doing. So, uh, the, uh, first toad. Uh, did we get? It? We, did we lose one from no. getting away from the rats? By the way. No. Oh yeah. Oh um. Probably. Yeah, you did. Well, you yeah. Get a danger point yeah, you got you got rid of the danger point for okay. getting rid of the rats. All right. So kill the danger so point. You ran away from that problem really well. Yeah. <laughs> yes. So because of this, uh, toad. Oh, no, I just yeah. got back. Yeah, lose danger point. Okay. Hops. Right. Hops up, being the first one up. Gets onto the windowsill. No, Real easy. Okay. Waits. <laughs> Waits. Oh, sorry. As Brother Fox Except scampers up, concept. you know, uh, climbing up over it. Um, but as Hare is bounding up, um, this you lose your footing a little bit and you have to scamper and you can feel the vines kind of uh, cracking and splintering beneath you. And as you do your final kick up onto the second floor, window with the rest of your friends, you watch as the overgrowth of the vines just and just like, oh. <laughs> like basically just wilts away from the tower. Well, somebody's gonna notice that. Yeah. Leaving a giant like long um, springboard of sorts uh, coming from about a story and a half up. Ooh. Okay, let's get in there and uh, move around so we're not sitting at the yeah. table crying. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, yes, yeah. good idea. Guys, I think we're offline. Uh, we are, but keep going because we have a we have a uh, internal recording. Oh. We'll okay. upload the full show after. Great. So okay. If you stop now, then we don't have any show. But we'll keep going for the next half hour, then at least oh. we finish it out. As a special treat for people who just tune in and don't see this live later and find out later, this is only for them. I love you. I love you guys. Uh, I love you guys. Tazen. Uh, they can't see you though. I love you guys. Okay, so you come on camera. Come, come and tell everybody you love them. Just come up, come back here. I love you. Bye. Oh, yeah, we got to do this. The internet was happening. Are we doing, are we doing? Please. I'm going to call you and see if we can. Yes, 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 yes. Hey, you're alive for some, guys, so go with that. Oh, okay. Well, hold on. Tell us if there's a lot of people that are seeing it. We're alive for subs. Uh, great. We love you, subs. You're on. You hop into the second floor tower of the South Wizard tower, and you find yourself amidst a rolling staircase spiraling up into the tower. Um, what do we smell? Which way is the scent? It's above you. Mm. You can what? definitely smell it. Okay. Which way is the scent, brother? Up. Let's go. I hop onto him. <laughs> Great. As you roll up to the stairs, it is, again, very late at night, so Should not many okay. people are running about. Uh, you get close to a couple of hallways and you continue to follow the scent, making a left, making a right, getting kind of deeper into the complex, but at the same time, very keen onto the scent. As you get closer, you notice a glimmer of light coming from underneath one of the doors. And as you get closer, you can tell, you can smell, she's on the other side of that door. Do we hear anything else? You hear the sound of writing, like pen on ink, pen on paper. Uh, and you can see a faint glow of light amidst the very, very dark. Thankfully, you're all nocturnal creatures. You can see in the darkness very easily, but there's just a faint glimmer of candlelight coming from underneath the door at the moment. I think I'm gonna scratch the door. Uh, then what happens when it gets open? We run in. All right, well, let's hope that we can come up I with like an exit confidence. strategy if it happens. I'm hearing yeah. that, and I'm liking that. I'm, I'm into it. I'm into it. Go ahead. Go. Okay. So you scratch at the door. Yeah. Hello. <clears throat> Whoa. Uh, Sex car. The door here. Um, okay. Sex car, ladies. So her. these are. Oh, yeah, okay, I'm down here. There are Twitch server issues. If you are currently watching and you see this, don't refresh. Because do not refresh. Yes, yeah, st <laughs> stick around. If you refresh, it'll probably drop the feed. But we're actually we are live, and like we're recording to our VOD right now. So keep doing the show, and the VOD is apparently going up as normal. 
Okay. Um, yeah, so it's just it's something on the Twitch side in terms of some users can't see it, but it is kind of live. So just Weird. go with Thanks, it. Twitch. It could be coastal even. We don't know. what We haven't been able to map which users can and can't. But like, If so you're still watching, we're yeah. still loving. If you're still watching, <laughs> keep watching. But don't refresh or you may lose us. And if you aren't watching now, then you're seeing this on VOD and we're happy to provide it for you. Thank yeah, you. we're happy to be back so you can watch us after the live, which is... Okay. There's nothing going on in the world right now, is there? Because whenever you say the word coastal, that freaks me out. Like, oh, okay. <laughs> well, there was Amazon S3 uh, Kaiju server is attacking issues, New York. So. That's what I'm worried about. Right. Yeah. Okay. It's all right. Sorry, New York. We've, got, we've, we've got men that operate machines. Top men. Mm. Top men. Mm -hmm. Going at it. What? Gypsy danger. Okay. <laughs> yeah, well Check said. Uh, in the meantime, uh, Fox is scratching at the door. Um, you basically hear like the sound of pen scrawling onto paper. Stop. Ever so suddenly. Get ready, get ready. I'll, I'll distract him. Yeah, I'll I'm distract. I'm right by the crack in the door. Right by the crack? Yeah. Get ready, and I'll be mm -hmm. right outside the door to run in. Okay. And uh, you hear... Ooh, I'm going to shake off some of that dirt. You hear someone putting their hands against the door, presumably like they're placing their ear up against it. Who's there? What? What is that? What? What? Is that dog in here? What? There shouldn't be any dogs in here. You hear as the door like unlocks and you hear a latch. Good thing I knocked. <laughs> and you hear a, a like a, a small memoring of someone like uh, doing a somatic gesture and a sound as you hear a fizzle come off and this door edges open ever so slightly to see a bunny. There. I know. I'll sit well, there too. I'll look at him. I run in! Uh, <laughs> as yes. you squeeze yourself through there, what? A rabbit. It's just bolt right through. Make a quick check. Yes! Yeah! Yeah! Oh, man. All right, you just, you just bolt your way right through. It's not quite big enough, but your little tiny hair body just squeezes right through <laughs> as if you just dart into the room. As he, Surprise, as, he, as he attempts to shut the door as hard as he possibly can, um, pushing it pushing it against, like leaving you inside, he slams the door oh. behind you. Well, did you, did you know? I just thought no, of something too. If it's a if it's a rabbit in a wizard school, it probably came out of somebody's hat. <laughs> One can only hope. <laughs> well said. Um, Saying. Slams this. Uh, well, you know, let's make it. Let's make it. I don't want to leave all of you out of this situation. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So he, uh, as you push through, he, he kind of like uh, attempts back. attempts to slam the door, but it, it kind of like comes back open as he sees both the fox and the and you the the, the toad. I'm gonna walk in. Uh, in there, and he goes, <laughs> "What? Animals? Gods? Somebody? Gods?" I'm gonna I start go. leaping around, parkouring around the room, <laughs> around, okay. causing maximum as you, mayhem. As you're clipping around, knocking over bottles, just causing. Havoc no, I Where's <laughs> our? You look around, you can see. <laughs> Would as someone really called the guards, though. There is a, just a bunny. There is a there is a table. Yeah, Wizard Tower, yeah. <laughs> in which the um, in which the uh, man is writing a note on there, and the note has uh, a hat box next to it. It seems to be like a round cylindrical thing as he seems to be, there seems to be an area where he was writing a note at uh, alongside of it. Um, you can't read. So uh, I think actually, ironically, I think Hope's character was the only one who could read and understand humans, but he was writing along it. Uh, as you hear him, can then you exclaim and run. He goes, he starts trying to grab the rabbit. Oh, get off of that, get away from there. Get no get as he attempts to try to grab you. Everything can keep making quick checks. Is, there, is quick there any way? Any um? Can I trip up his feet? Absolutely. I'm gonna trip up his feet. Good. I want to hop oh. inside and hop Dude, to the top. Dude, or not? Or die. Top or not the table. Min max. I'm bringing okay. it. Yeah. Not so much with tripping up his feet. <laughs> you did whatever you were trying. To do. I don't know what I was. I don't know you were you were getting was. onto the table. Correct. So you're hopping onto the chair. Yes. And then up onto the table. What is that task rating? That task rating is simple. Okay, I did it. Great. I am a tiny brown blur 
<laughs> pinging okay. around the I office. I did not manage to trip up his feet. <laughs> okay, so you, you attempt to trip up his feet, but he's running everywhere trying to grab this rabbit as you're knocking right. over books. Get the head! Get the head, man! Is there anything um, I can knock over that he might trip over? I'm going to look around and see if there's anything I can knock uh, over. There's so many things, but he, but she's knocking over everything mm -hmm. as he's kind of coming around trying to trying to basically grab a hold of this hair. Stupid rabbit! Get! 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 Get here! Get, what? Somebody! You can't get me! You can't get me! I'm going to look for something else again. To try again. Uh... <laughs> Or so so and um how long does it take to uh yeah well so it's it's fine if you want to keep tripping him up that's fine is there a window there is not a window in the room okay uh however if there is uh uh yeah, i'm sorry do you because you already attempted to trip him right and it didn't have through by the way take a danger point for the okay. failure as well too right. um if you want actually this is easier than just doing what i was thinking you trip him up, but you also hurt yourself in the meantime. So yes. as you're kind of getting in between his feet, he slips and trips onto it, but he also lands on you That's with okay. a yip as you kind of land onto it as he pushes himself I up. I instinctively bite, you know? Uh, <laughs> he landed on me. What? <laughs> a fox? A, a fox is here too. What? Oh, no. Oh. As you see, he's kind of having this reaction like, uh. no. Wait! I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna lunge up towards his. Ah, uh, no, that's a. No, no, it's no. It's fine. No, if you want to do it, that's a fierce. If you want to go get a hold of him, that's yeah, a fierce. I'm gonna lunge up towards his face. Okay. As he is it, going for it. it. Um, Toad. I want to open the hat box. <laughs> you open Tip up the over. hat box. Tip it over. And you see, you see, there is a bag that distinctly has blood all around it. And He's you distinctly go. smell the witch. What kind, of, what kind of bag? Like a burlap sack? Like a burlap sack. Okay. Yes. Eleven. Eleven? All right, so you latch onto him and you bite him. And he's holding onto, he's trying to grab you. Oh, no! Oh, stupid animals! You watch as he's attempting to, um, you watch as he attempts to do a little bit of a somatic gesture. Hey, you want to you wanna get in here? <laughs> uh, but there's, but he's he's you latched onto his neck as he's, he's, just, you're, he's just holding onto you, doing everything he can to keep you off. I'm gonna um, chew. Yeah, chew. chew. <laughs> All right. Need some chewing. chewing. Oh, get off! Oh. All right. So, uh, so you're still bounding around, making yeah. a mess out of things. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Okay. And then Toad, you revealed the burlap sack with the head into it. I want to telepathically lash out, reach out. Yeah. And say, Fox, we need you to carry this. Let's switch places. And then I want to attempt to jump on the man's face. Yeah. And hold on to his face. <laughs> Why don't we just kill him? Like, suffoca yeah. like suffocating him with yes. your toe body? Just just kill him. He's got our uh, witch. No, well, that's we what shouldn't. What if, it, what if it's this duty's master? Is this duty's master? Uh, you, you never. It's Can we smell not it? Duty's. Well, we would actually. Know. We'd be able to smell him. Yeah, it is duty's master. Uh, right. All right. Don't so kill I'm going to keep duty occupied <laughs> yeah. on our walk. Right. Because okay. I can hear what's happening in my telepathic. All right. All right, well, Let's I'm not gonna... kill this guy. Just distract right, him and get the head out. <laughs> well, I, I need to jump up onto his head. Right, so that's a fierce. Fox. Okay. How difficult was that? Uh, simple. I will use one Benny. Okay. Hit it. <laughs> that's it. Last one. No more. Oh. Uh, use it. And we're not live, so. <sighs> Nobody can help us now. No. All right. The door's open, though, right? The door's open. Good. I'm going to grab. Oh, wait. Yeah. Grab the bag. Grab wait, the wait, bag. This is bag. I'm gonna grab the. I'm gonna jump up on the table, grab the bag, and uh, head out the door. Let's go. Okay. So we grab the bag. You latched onto his face. He goes, "Toad, toad, what?" He, as he kind of grabs you and like softball pitches you out. As you, I run out the door too. As you all run it through the door, and he goes, "All right, now I'm jumping for the uh, the springboard uh, vine, and hopefully it'll." I'm jumping out the window. I'm jumping out the window. Yeah. Uh, as you all run out Same. the door, as you're going down the staircase, you can see as the man, you know, holding on to his bleeding neck, stands up and goes, ah, <clears throat> "Your Elizabeth's familiars! Damn you! Damn you! I thought he was supposed to take care of you, idiot!" Ugh! As he holds on to it, you watch as he is attempting a. Uh, do we need his eyes? We have no idea what he's saying, do we? We have nope. no idea what he's saying. Do we need his eyes? No. Uh, no. As he is like holding on, you watch as he, he attempts to do something somatic, but then his, his hand just uh, comes down as he grasps the hold of his neck again. As you get close to the window, um, uh, nine with quick. Oh! Mm. Dirty 10. Damn it. 
Dirty tan, bitches. Dirty tan. Dirty tan. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Take a danger point. Bye. I, I, I come right. through when it's necessary. All right. I will jump out the window as well. Okay. Wait, we just you escaped said? a dangerous situation, though. Shouldn't she? Uh. Clear a danger point for that. E- well, you escape. You haven't escaped from the dangerous situation yet. I You're still know. in the dangerous situation. <laughs> right. <laughs> all right. All right. What? Right. Is it? What? what uh, uh, For you, it's actually basic. I mean, you're a frog. You can leap, and then you're lighter than everything else. Okay, so for me, it's basic. Okay, I did. It's it's not basic. It is basic seven. Seven. Basic. Oh, hit it. Hit it. Good. Okay, so Toad hops out and kind of glides down. With his body. I grab body. my skin and then. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Flying too. I, I inflate my uh, throat, <laughs> and then I'm a hot air balloon as I float <laughs> down to the ground. Uh, <laughs> and then, do you want to describe to me how you make a graceful two-story the leap? The quick brown fox <laughs> <laughs> jumped over. All right, I'm C-fox going to. Run. I'm going to um. The choking wizard. <laughs> run down the stairs, yeah. and I'm going to take a, a a leap and bounce off the wall. Mm-hmm. And, Twist towards the window, <laughs> gracefully out the window. Look down. Notice that the uh, the vines are have, have flapped over, and I'm going to hit the vine. Roll, uh, hit the vine, tuck and roll, and roll down, not losing the witch's head. Yeah. Roll out, land on my feet, stand up, ah, shake a little off, <laughs> and get out of sight. <laughs> okay. So all three of you uh, uh, get out from the mix of stables. Bill turns around and goes. Whoa! <laughs> that was crazy! <laughs> <laughs> that was wild! Uh, and you uh, uh, you can you can hear Duty turn around and hear his ears perk up and goes, Oh crap. Was that was that Bill? Oh shit, Bill's in trouble! Is there is there is there a water trial anywhere? Well it's so stable, yeah. Good. I'm gonna go rinse my mouth out. Okay. Yeah, uh, uh, are you putting so the bag down and in your mouth out? Yes, because I don't want to smell like his master's blood. <laughs> you your mouth out. And you grab but the you bag. you didn't kill him, right? No, we okay. didn't kill him. <laughs> as, you, as you double back out, right. uh, you... You don't uh, need to be seen. You need right, to be so I've tucked and rolled, and I'm a little, like, banged up and dazed. Yeah, you but actually... You, you make got a beeline a, to save You've got a little bit of a limp yeah. on one of your legs as well, too, as you're moving forward. Ah. Um, and then you hear his uh, a duty go, Bill's in trouble. We, we gotta go back. Uh, okay. Come on, man, let's go. All right. And they start running across. <laughs> and um, continues to, to purse through, purse through. Uh, as, as you all kind of double back to the stables. He goes, Bill, 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 what happened? <laughs> what happened, Bill? Well, I just saw the darndest thing. I saw a hare, a fox, and a toad jump out of the window with a burlap sack. <laughs> when do you see that any day? Bill, wait, what? You said a, a hare, a fox, and a toad? Wait a minute. <laughs> he looks to you and goes, Flash, explain yourself. Okay, it sounds like it's my friend. It may or may not be. I don't uh, think there's any other toads or hares or foxes in this whole this little town. town. It's a big town. There's hares and foxes and toads are commonplace amongst uh, areas of human activity that have rivers flowing through them. And Flash, I think you need to go, man. All right. I'm going to go find out what's going on. All right. You get back over. You, you know. But wait. I did promise Bill earlier that I'd let him free. <laughs> <laughs> and I don't go back on my promises. Okay. So before I go, I will go, duty. But you have to let me. Well, you're telling us to duty? Yeah. Okay. Duty, before I go, I, I, I promised Bill I would let him free. Oh, no, dude. That's not cool. Like that, what do you mean? That's the whole point of why I'm here, is to guard the horses. The horses aren't supposed to leave. Bill says that all the time, don't you, Bill? I oh, damn do there, duty. Well, oh, Uncle Bill just says it all the time because he always wants to run out, but hey, man, I'm going to get in a shit ton of trouble if you let Bill out. Bill, why would you do that, man? <laughs> all right, so now I'm in a conundrum, duty. I have promised Bill that I'd let him go. Well, I'm sorry, but I can't let that happen. Bill? Yeah. Well, what do you think, Bill? What, what what should I do here? 
Well, I was really looking forward to getting out, but duty's duty is his duty. So, uh, all right. Well, so do you? For, will you? Will you, uh, will you let me uh, off the hook? Yeah. Will you you did. You here? did promise, though, Flash. And that is I, something of a sacred word. I was really looking forward to a little running around. I Tell did me. promise. How about this? But Bill knew when you promised that it was Duty's job, and he knew you were friend Duty. So that was a Tell, that was a pretty cross promise. Tell Bill he, he can come with us when like the witch is back and everything, and he could become a witch's horse. Yeah, that'd okay. be pretty sweet. Bill, what do you think of this? So, if I get if I accomplish my mission, and Get uh, do the things I need to do, and the witch comes back to life. I'll come get you then, because I promised Duty I'd get him then too. So therefore, I'm sure Duty's not going to care if you run out if we're both leaving. Hey man, don't talk to Bill. Bill's just feeding you stuff. Like this is <laughs> this is this is between him and me, man. This is this is my thing. You can only take my thing away from me. No, I'm not taking away from you right now. If you this, wanna... is my, this is all I got is this stable and those horses. You know what, Flash. It's fine. I can hang out here. Don't worry about me. All right, Bill. But I will be back for both of you. <sighs> As you walk away, you can hear uh, like you hear duty yelling at Bill's like, Bill, I swear, dude, you're always doing this shit, pulling this kind of crap. Because <laughs> it, gets, cause it comes out. Bill. Um, <laughs> and that actually is going to leave us for this yeah. episode. As we, uh, as we move on to next week, as we continue The Witch is Dead for one more round. We got her head. The Witch you is got Dead, her but head. we got her head. Yeah. That's the first thing. Real good. Of course, now, where are we going to put it? Yeah, that was, that was a concern. <laughs> I'll let you think about that a little bit. Um, guys, uh, make sure to tune in uh, tomorrow. Or uh, you've, you've, the first episode of Werewolf for Foreververse is finally being uploaded to YouTube. So it's the up. pilot was uploaded last week. You've all, I know all you out there, you've all watched it. If you're just tuning in for the first time, you can check out that first episode then. If you're loyal followers, make sure to share it. Tell other people about the fact that it's available for you to watch now. And that they can catch up, not only on the first episode on YouTube, but also every episode's up on Project Alpha as well. Literally all 25 episodes cool. or so are there, available for your friends to watch. So, um, great. We'll see you next week, guys. Thank you, Erica. Thanks, Thanks so much for having yeah. so yeah. so so me. She will be here next week as well, too. She's not going away, but welcome to the Forever family. Yay! So. Oh, my God. Oh, okay. All right, guys. We'll see you next week. Tune in next week, and uh, see you next week. Next week. <laughs> Hey everybody, thanks for watching this episode of Foreververse. Make sure to like and comment and subscribe as we'll be releasing episodes on every Thursday on GNS's YouTube, starting with the first episode right here. If you'd like to jump ahead to the current point in our campaign, you can always watch us live on Twitch, Wednesdays at 3 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. If you want to watch Foreververse episodes that are available right now, you can always go to projectalpha.com. They are all there for you. And if you want to watch episodes that we've already released on YouTube, there's this fun little playlist right here. Thanks. Goodbye. <laughs>